Welcome back to Quiz Plays Quasimorph. We are, of course, picking up right where we left off. We, we've been playing a little bit, a little bit here and there. We've progressed past the tutorial, I believe. Um, so I don't really know what we're going to do, who we're going to work for, like in the long run. But I don't know. We'll, we'll figure that out when, you know, when we get our, our legs under us a little bit. For now, I mostly just want to, you know, try to build up. Why do we have one of those like that? I don't know. I want to build up more um, meds and supplies. We have a lot of stuff in here, but it's not really enough. There, you, you know, there's five empty tabs, and you can the tabs go on for forever. I need more stuff than this, so we're gonna try to keep building stuff up just however we can. I'll worry about you know min maxing the uh, the the factions a little bit down the road. Um, and there are new stations that we that didn't exist before. Havoc wasn't a place when I last played. The Citadel One here wasn't a place when I last played. It just didn't exist. Um, neither is uh, Sol Solkovsky here. Um, a couple of these places are, are newer, so I'm, I'm wondering if there's something like special about them or if they're just normal. So we might try to check those out. Um, Havoc's really far away. Citadel One's really far away. What about Tol uh, Tol Scott? Toy Soy Soy Sol Solkovsky? I don't know how to say that word, man. Um, there's no jobs here right now, but in 15 days there probably will be. So let's let's head on over here. Let's let's give it a try. And, okay, yeah, that stuff's done. I'm going to. Before we head over for the next, like, 20 days, I'll build more stuff. Um, it's a really good change that you can build stuff in here while you're traveling. Just because you used to waste, like, 20 days traveling. There was no way to fix the problem or whatever. Um, like, you just had to build stuff that took forever or just waste time. But now I can build stuff while I'm, flown, like, flying over. <clears throat> but, yeah, I'm already out of powder. So we've made all our powder there. So I'll just make more food. I was going to make more uh, shotgun shells, but we don't have powder for it. So that's fine. More food is fine. And if we have plastic, I'll keep making food. As long as we have plastic, the food will be good. Okay, we have a lot of plastic, apparently. I didn't think we had 15 more. Okay, do we have more plastic? Okay, we do. I, I Okay, there we go. We're finally out. I was like, I know I picked up some, but how much did I pick up? Jeez. But there we go. We finally ran out. And you just travel right through the planets. Um, okay, this is just a weird space station. All right, cool. Infinite plastic works, yes, infinity plastic. All the plastics. But we, we did finally run out. And we got lots of food. Um, and the food, it turns back into plastic. When you eat a moo, it gives you a plastic pack, so. Um, this, I won't carry all the plastic. Like, I'll forget some sometimes. I'll, I'll decide to drop some sometimes, so. I do need a surplus of it, but this should be like infinity moo, -moo more or less. So let's see. Well, let's see. Is there anything I want to craft at all? I know we could have crafted on the way over if there really was, but just double check. A lens and a metal pipe. Okay. So I might want this gun. We'll, we'll worry about that in the future, but I'm, if I can bring lenses out, I'll try. I'll try to bring a lens with me, if possible. Okay, so let's see what's here. Um, The lamb, Land Scrona Center. Sure. Oh, it's four diffi four star difficulty? Okay, so I've never done a four skull difficulty mission. Um, We've only done like the one and two skulls. I don't think I could do a four skull. I could be wrong. It's for it's for the Church of Revelation. I don't really like them. At least I didn't like them before. Maybe they're good now, but previously I didn't think they were that good. Okay, can we go somewhere else? Um, can we go to the moon? It, the the nearer places, like the moon and Fuller, whatever Fuller is, because they're physically nearer. Um, it takes less time to get there, so we could go to the moon like pretty quickly. So we'll see what jobs are there right now. Oh no, these will actually both be over. I was going to say we'll see what jobs are there right now, and you can see um, on the on the pop up here on MTZ, time remains is two point six days, and then travel time down here is three point eight days. So the, both of these jobs will be over because this one's also going to be done before we're there. So my initial statement that we could get there and and do the jobs we saw is a lie. And there's there's a a a, a, t a defense mission, but it's also four stars. Earth? Do you have anything on Earth? No. Hmm. <laughs> we'll travel here, maybe, because those jobs will be done. Maybe new jobs will show up in their place. We'll try it. Let's try it. So we'll see if they got some stuff. Okay, there's something new. Okay, okay. It's for Corward against the Church of R. So as I was saying, I don't respect them that much, so I'm okay fighting against them. The only downside is I didn't respect Corward very much either before, but it looks like they have new stuff now. They have like an armor set and stuff, so maybe they're good. You know, there's been a whole a whole lot of changes since I whole lot of changes since I last played, so I should really, you know, like 
um, you know, try to give everything a fair shake. So sure, we'll do this. And it's um, relatively easy. Two skulls. I don't think it will die or anything. So I mean, maybe we'll die, but it, we should be able to do a little bit of work. Oh, it tells you how many floors there are, too. It used to not tell you that. Um, so we only have to go to floor two. That'll be really easy. That's super, super fine. We can definitely do this. 100 rounds, food, ammo, meds. Yeah, we got this, chat. I'm really confident. Let me sip some tea here. That tea was way too hot, chat. I should have let that tea cool off a little bit. <laughs> that was like burning hot. Um, this is just lore. You don't need to read this. Um, it's, they, there's always lore at the beginning of each mission. I don't read it out. It's probably good lore, but it takes a lot of time. We'll, 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 we'll leave the lore reading for someone else. I'm sure there's someone that will read it. I'm sure lots of folks do. Oh, so, yes, yeah, so I was... Oh, no, that guy woke up. Um, I was talking about this on the last stream. If, if these people, like, they're asleep, if I had a suppressed weapon, I could kill this person and it wouldn't wake them up. Or if I just meleeed him to death, like if I had a dagger, I could just stab him to death, it wouldn't wake them up either, so. You can be a stealth gamer. So I'm gonna go fully auto, because if I blast him, there's a fair chance I blast this guy too. And again, our gun's not quiet, so. We're gonna click to try to blast this guy, and this will just this guy will die in the, the collateral. Maybe not die. Nah, he's pretty weak, he'll die. Yeah, kill both of them. Okay, not bad. Oh, there's another one. Room clear now. Oh no, one more. Okay, and that thing was jamming my radar. Um, there's another one somewhere jamming the radar, so I can't actually use my minimap. Chemical processor. We have one of those at home. Might as well take the other one with me here. Spiritual bonds. Mind control device. What? They are called acolytes. Okay, that's new. I don't think I want that. I should break it down. What does it turn into? Cloth or rag? And I don't, I don't think we need this many rags. Like, I, I think I can stop breaking these down, but... I don't know. You know, I don't know. I don't know what's what's good and bad anymore. On the on the old patch, I could tell you what what maybe I wanted and didn't want, but on this patch, I'm like, I don't know, man. I kind of might as well have never played before. I'm so like, you know, unfamiliar. That's not really true. I'm very familiar with like the the standard mechanics of the game. I'm just not familiar with the uh, the meta of like what I should and shouldn't like loot things like that. Sorry, I pulled the map up there because I muted myself for a moment. Mm, and I wonder why they're all asleep. Oh, because of Somnia. Um, so I said I would explain this when we were on a planet with Quasimorphing, and then we're here. Um, and I didn't explain it, so I should now. So Somnia, that means sleep in like Latin or something. But that's why everyone's asleep. Because the Quasimorph is under 100, it's in the Somnia phase. And that's the Q-Morphosis phase, so it's just it's the Quasimorph phase. And there's a bunch of stats here. Ecolapse chance, muscle mass, damage resistance, regenera regeneration, and aggression. Um, I'll explain Ecolapse last. So the rest pretty much makes sense. Aggression is like how aggro the enemies are going to be, um, specifically the Quasimorphed enemies. Re regeneration is whether or not they're going to heal and how much they're going to heal. Damage res is just armor. And muscle mass is like, I think, their ability to do physical damage to you, like melee damage. It gets like a multiplier. Um, but then the, the final one, Ecolapse Chance. This is the one that needs some explaining, because the rest of the stats, again, they make sense. This doesn't mean anything. Um, Ecolapse Chance is the percentage chance that an enemy, one of these folks, either on kill or not on kill, just at random, will explode into a Quasimorph. So the lore is that we awakened Quasimorphs, like we are shifted somehow. Um, and now aliens from another dimension, like demonic alien creature, I don't know, um, just explode out of people. Like they take the physical body of someone. Um, so these dudes have a chance of just exploding either, you know, at random or on death. Um, and then they'll turn into a Quasimorph. And the Quasimorphs are the various alien enemies of the game that we've yet to encounter because we were doing all our missions on uh, Mars previously, where again, the Quasimorphs don't exist for reasons unexplained. Uh, I was hoping that was a light wound. We'll splint it. That's fine. And I really like what they've done with the healing. Um, previously, weren't there? you wouldn't get, like, fractures and stuff like that. Um, so specifically. Well, you would get a fracture, but it would just be generic fracture. There wouldn't be, like, heavy wounds, light wounds, things of that nature. So I like what they've done. Memory records. This is just something to trade. I'll eat this because it, it generates a can, which we can stack, and then I can put it here. And I am drunk. 
um, which makes me less accurate, but that's okay. I maybe shouldn't have eaten that. I can become addicted to alcohol, um, and I had a chance of getting addicted off that drink. Even a single sip is enough to get you addicted in this game, it seems, so don't drink. That's the moral of the lesson. Do not drink. Um, but it's we didn't get addicted, so it's okay. And we have a can, and cans are actually pretty useful. Despite seeming maybe like garbage, they, they actually serve like a pretty solid purpose. They are, they are not a bad tool. Excuse me. And you can sneak through catty corners like that. Like, this looks like it's a wall that you couldn't really pass through. Like, they're touching, but you can pass through it. The rune system feels reminiscent of Stone Shard. Crouton, from what I understand, this game is made in Stone Shard's engine. People used to tell me that. I can't confirm that. But, um, a lot of this game might feel reminiscent of Stone Shard. Because I think it is. I know they're both, um... Uh, published by the same publisher, and I think they're, like, the companies that are making the games, like, physically live, like, near each other. Like, they're both in, um, like, Ukraine. Um, so I, it, 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 I, I think that's because they, like, it literally is the same system. Or, like, the same base coding. I could be wrong. Again, I can't confirm that, but chat used to tell me that, so. Um, it, it's, it's, I believe, the same. Like, not even just similar. Well, no, again, not not fully the same. Like they they are they're doing different things, but um, but yeah, I think the coding's the same. And please, no swearing, Crouton. I generally time timeout swears, but I'm gonna let that one go. That one gets to stay. Makes a lot of sense. They're both in the same publisher. Yeah, so it's not under the same like devs. Like the the folks devving the games are different people, but they're both being published by Hype Train Digital. So shout out to them. Um, and this is a quasi morph. Uh, that the lady was just talking about. And you're good. You're good. It happens. Um, the lady was talking about um quasi morphing. Uh, it, the dude, I killed him. He turned into this creature. It's a, it's a creature of the Brahm Fatra, of the moon. So on the moon, you fight Brahm Fatra. On Venus, you fight Texclon. And other places, you fight other aliens. I could be wrong about the Texclon thing, but I think that's correct. So, um, as this number shows up, or goes up, more and more scary quasi-morphs are gonna show up, and they're gonna have better stats. And you might be like, well, Quist, what can I do, um, to stop the number from going up? You can drink alcohol. That thing I drank earlier, the the, the thing that we, we chucked, it, it removes Quasimorph. You can also smoke cigarettes and do other things like that. Um, and then you might be like, well, what's causing Quasimorph to go up in the first place? Everything you do, moving, shooting, passing a turn, it just goes up. Um, some things like eating raw human flesh makes it go up really quickly, um, but just existing makes it go up. So right there, it went up by like six. So that was like a lot. And um, I left the Quasimorph alive because they, as they, like, teleport in, like, phase in, they take no damage for a few turns. He was glowing orange. I should have mentioned it. I apologize. He's not orange right now. But there's a few turns um, where they, or maybe, like, a full turn. I don't know. But they have a little while where they can't be damaged. They don't do anything either. They don't attack or anything. Um, so they're not a threat. But you, you can't shoot them right away. Waiting for the fire to go out. It'll, it'll go out eventually. And it can't catch the blood on fire because the blood is wet. And stuff on the other side caught on fire, too. So I'm assuming there's no monsters, like, right around there. Yeah, it looks like there might have been dead people there. Yeah, corpse. So the explosion did way more work than I thought. I tried to kill one guy, and it looks like it killed, like, six people. Like, there were a lot of people it killed. Oh, rotten meat, moldy food. Maybe they were dead from before. Maybe they were dead from before. Different engine, but, like, uh, but yes, most things are used, like, some things uh, as they are the same company. Usually some things as they are the same company. Wait, are they the same company, Tio? Like, is the company that makes this game the same as um, Stone Shard? I thought they were a different company. If they're the same, that's really cool. That is very Pog. Um, but yeah, I, there, there's there's some obvious similarities. Like, the you know, backpack. and Or not, like, the backpack itself, but, like, the limited inventory size and other things. <laughs> I wouldn't be shocked if they, they had spoken with each other before. And Qua uh, Quasimorph and Stone Shard are very different games. But there are, you know, some similarities, and the healing system in particular is is very, you know, very similar. Was there Unity? Well, uh, Stone Shard is gaming. Oh, okay, different devs, uh, different devs, same publisher. Okay, that's that's what I thought. Also, first time chatter, Fo Jane, welcome on in. Fo 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 again? Fo Agni? I don't know how to say that, but welcome on in, Fo. Um, hope you're enjoying the show so far. But I I thought they were made uh, in the same engine, so my bad. I was misspeaking earlier, or not just misspeaking, just lying. I didn't, I didn't stumble over my words and say something wrong. I was just wrong. And we'll eat that, though we did not need the calories because I wanted space. Um, so that was a bit wasteful, but I don't know. Sometimes the space is worth it. Okay. And we raided um, a streamer yesterday after the show ended. 
And they were in a place where like they were like they the game gave them like infinite Oh, that's a mind chip. We're getting out of here. Um that's a new character. Possibly. It could be one of the starter characters as well. But that could be a new character. Um But the uh we raided someone yesterday and they were they were playing, of course, Quasimore Faraday, like a Quasimore streamer. And they they had like infinity loots and they kept doing like the same mission. Um, and it was like tough enemies. I want to find like figure out where they were. I don't I don't know where they were or what they were doing. Um, that 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 area they were at was not in the game before. So I want to I want to figure out what that is. It seemed like like a like I don't know like a practice area or something. Oh yeah, Jackie's Canet or Jackie's. I don't I don't know if it's Jackie's Jacques. I don't know, but it's it's Jack Jack Canet. Um, we'll drop the rotten meat. I I think I need rotten meat for antibiotics, but we'll drop it. So um I can leave. I don't have to finish the job. Because I picked that up, that's about- Whoa, where did you come from? I didn't realize there was a guy there. It scared the life out of me. Um, but because I picked that up, that's a valuable enough item that they're gonna let me leave even though I didn't finish the mission. So, we're gonna do that. Um, because I really want that character. Like, every character is just, you know, an additional tool in my tool set, so I want it. This lamp, maybe I want? I don't know, I'm gonna leave it for now. I'm gonna leave the lamp for now. Okay, there's a lot of lamps. They do stack. I'll drop one rubber for these lamps. Was I think there's three total? Or is there just two? Was I looking at the same body? Wait, was I looking at the same body every single time? I was. There's there's one lamp. I thought it was three and then two and it's actually just one. All right, so I'm insane. That's what we've discovered. I'll trade the lamp out for a cyborg head. These used to be relatively good trade. So I'm assuming there's still decent trade. Ooh, what do you have in your hand? Is that a hunter? Okay, yeah. Kind of scary, but not super scary. Um, And this is a robot. I would love to chop his body up. Ah, gee, ah, I didn't think they could shoot me. I thought if I hid back here, they couldn't shoot. But this is, you can see through this. My, I'm dumb. Um, but this robot could, oh, they quasi-morphed. Dang it. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. So, are they moving? They, they went the other way, though. They didn't go through the door. Oh, I should heal. We have time to heal. Uh, just, just put a rag on that for now. And then we'll eat uh, sorbent for the, the infection. Okay. So, the, I think there's a quasi-morph right here. Dude, the... I forgot! In the new patch, enemies don't... If the, if the enemies naturally wouldn't be friends, they're not. Um, on the In the old patch, AI would all all ignore each other and kill you. Now the robots and the quasimorphs aren't friends, so they were fighting each other. That was sick, dude. That was really cool to see. Um, I'm really, really impressed with the update so far. That's such a nice change. Yeah, it really is. The whole, like, the whole update seems great. And I keep drawing attention to this. I've said it before, but, like, look at how much resistance I have. And I'm in the early game. This gear is clearly like decent, um, but they've they've given you so much more armor and raised the damage on guns, like slightly lesser than they raised the armor. So there's less one shotting, which was my my like biggest complaint about the game was that there was no real difficulty. You either just died or didn't die. There was no like grind, you know, to try to like you know beat the level. You just either beat it or you got one shot. So it seems like it's much better. Like they've really changed that. Um, which I, I appreciate a lot. And I'm gonna swap that out, because that's just rags, which I didn't even think I wanted earlier. And this is ammunition, which I definitely want. So I need something sharp to chop up this robot. Chopping up the robot's good. I wonder if those buzz buzzsaws are still super lethal. I think they are, which like I will continue to cry about, but I, you know, I think that they're in intended to be, um... Oh, chance of recovery, 60%, remains for 10 turns. What is that? Wait, what? Whoa, whoa there's a guy here. I was, I was looking at the health. I wasn't worried about this guy. Hold up. Also, why are you so thick, brother? I mean, let me go full auto for this guy. Okay. So wait, is the, what was up with this? Seven remains? Okay. That's cool. So it's going to heal itself. Maybe because I put the rag on, it has a chance to heal itself. And this is a minor wound self-healing. Okay, I'll let that live. I'll take the ammo. Oh, and we're finally hearing the music. Um, because the quasi-morphing is going up, the music starts changing. If we, when we do this mission again, because we're going to leave real quick. Oh, there we go. There's something sharp. Uh, a broken arm. Um, like a, a sharpened bone. But when we, when we come back, the Quasimorph will probably get pretty high, and we'll get to hear some really sick metal. The game gets, like, pretty intense. Um, so now that I have the sharp weapon, I can dissect. Uh, oh, yeah, and it's just left-click to dissect enemies. You have to double-click yourself, but it's left-click on enemies. Okay, that's Pog. That's Pog. I think I was not doing that before. Um... So did we get anything good? I, I was hoping for another cyborg's head or another one of these. We might have actually gotten some of these. I have six in my inventory and I don't know how much I had before. Okay, nothing special other than that. So let's go ahead and leave. 
So this was a, a very quick mission because we're, we're just, you know, turning tail to, to get, get the chip out of here and reset. But because I'm leaving and not completing the mission, I'm able to try it again. So it's it'll be reset, so I get to kill all these people again and, like, you know, farm loot off of them and stuff, so it's good. <laughs> Did I get, like, one green chip before? Okay, yeah, I only have one of these? Okay, if I got, like, five off that, that robot body, that's really good. They're a decent trade. They're not, like, the greatest trade of all time, but they're decent. All right, so we'll evac. Really good start. Really good first mission right there. Easy, you know, good, good money. Everything about that was great. And I will take the big bone with us, sure. Um, I'll put my ammo away. We'll put this away. We'll put this away. I mean, my dog just kind of like let out a little cry. I need to see what's up with him. He's probably okay, but I need to make sure he doesn't need anything. Need more highballs for sale? I'm not sure. I don't. I don't know if I think they've changed that Roush. I think in the modern patch, the the body parts aren't aren't as valuable. Um, oh, the ammo we crafted. Let's go. I don't think they wanted it to be like that, where we're like you know chopping off your arm at the end of every raid was like the best way to get trade value. Um, so I think they, they, they changed that. But let me AFK for just one moment, make sure my pupper's uh, not in need of anything. I think he's fine. I put him back under his blankie. He just went out there and, I don't know, cried. He's just upset sometimes. He just gets upset at the neighbors and stuff. But he's fine. Thank you for, of course, bearing with me during my little AFK. Uh, when did I get this? I remember picking this up. I remember picking this up. But when did I get this? And did these not stack? Oh, yeah, I got another one. I thought they would stack. I bet these are good trade value, then. If they don't stack, I bet they're really solid trade value. Um, we still have food, meds, everything. Okay, a finished mission and run it right back. So we'll just go right in again. Oh, yeah, and we have uh, we have Jack here. Um, their skill is that they can reload quickly. Reload duration, uh, negative two. So overall, they're decent. Like, they have, like, really good, like, overall stats. Um, like, nothing too spectacular, but nothing really that bad. Like, medium health, medium everything, and then quick reloads. They're, they're a good character. Um, I still think Percy's the very best. Or I used to think Percy was the very best. So far, I'm still of that opinion. But I, do, I won't know. There might be new characters. Maybe the meta has changed a little bit. But the um, the, the flat 150 health that Percy gets, um, and it's 165 now because of this. Um, the character only has 150. The, the, the class is giving him 15 more. But um, the flat 150 health combined with the, uh, the extra 10 resistances that Percy gets made him just really, really tanky. Like significantly tankier than any of the other characters. So I found Percy to be far and away the best character before. But maybe, maybe uh, on the new patch, that's not true. As I've said, you know, over and over, we'll have to we'll have to test it out and see. And I'm I'm kind of wondering what's up with these acolytes. I want to know what's up with that. I'm sure we'll find some like higher level enemies that will you know. And that's not a uh, mine ship. It's green. I thought it was a mine ship, but it's not. For a moment, I was like, ooh, but nah, it's just a green little dude. I think it's like a medicine of some kind, like a sorbent or something like that. But eventually we should find some people that are like higher level than Acolyte and their title will be like, I don't know, like, like Grand Vampire or something. You know, I don't know, but it'll explain why these people are having their mind controlled. Whatever the, the leaders are, we'll, we'll have, you know, their, their lore explained. Senior Acolyte, yeah, something like that. Also, I hope you're well, Coviers. Um, so the, the uh, elevator to go down is just right here. So I'm just going to go straight down. I don't need to explore the floor very much. We could. I don't think it's, you know, very threatening. Um, and we have, like, skills I would like to level. And, you know, going in, you know, while we're not under a lot of threat might be a great time to level these because these involve you getting attacked. But I'm just going to leave. A six-pack in the med bay, the best kind of medicine. Yeah, I don't know what they were oh, inventory. Oh, I'm on sprint. I didn't mean to be. I'm burning through calories. My bad. Um, hold up. Yeah, I don't know what this was doing in the meds, the med bay. but And I don't even think this is beer. I'm pretty sure this is these are bottles of liquor. Like these, these look like liquor bottles from the game. Like the the um, the individual like golden, not golden, but like orangish amber uh, alcohol is like a bottle of whiskey, I think. Um, so they, it is that is like they are they are they're partying in the med bay. I do not believe that alcohol is like rubbing alcohol. That is that is drinking alcohol, and it is some strong stuff. 
But you know what, dude? They live in a weird world. Aliens are aliens are exploding out of their the, the dead bodies of their comrades. Let, let them drink, I guess. They can drink whatever they want. I'm not going to judge them. Um, well, yeah. Yeah, I'll leave that stuff there. No, I'll take rubber instead of plastic. No, because we'll stack... Nah, take rubber instead of plastic. That's fine. We're leaving soon enough that I won't have to eat that much food. So we'll take the ammo. Do this. And what I should do real quick... This is like min maxi, but it's good to do. Is I can put some ammo in there. Um, and I can put the gun back here or whatever if I want. Um, and I don't really need that, but we might chop up a robot with it. Um, and we will actually right here. But either way, because the ammo's in this gun, I can fill more ammo in this, like, this stack. I can, you know, fill up the entire stack still. And I have ammo in the gun, so it's better. And we'll chop up this robot. And let's see. Do we get a bunch of PCBs? Only one this time. But we still could have got, like, six last time. Um, you know, I wasn't paying attention, so we could have gotten five then. One now, but five then. It's anesthesia. Yes, there we go. Yeah, it's, it's just it's just some pain meds. It's anesthesia. That's all. Just puts them to sleep during the surgeries and such. Purely medical use, of course. Wait, wait. Don't I know where they? I I, I do this a lot. Where I'll find the elevator and then I start like wandering. I, I just I'm too scatterbrained. So there's no way I could probably shoot my way through, but that would be insane. I'll just walk over from here. This is fine. Just an acolyte, right? Okay, I thought they maybe looked a little different, but nah. I, they had the headset on, so I was like, nah, you're the same dude. But it is like a low-tier mission, so maybe I won't find anyone other than acolytes. I'll eat the noodles, sure. I'll eat some noodles, why not? There's a lot of acolytes walking at me. Thankfully, they just die in like one or two shots, but they are coming from both ways. Ah, the Quasimorph, that's the problem. And I said we might start... Ooh, there's another one right there. We would get the sick metal music, but this raid's gonna be, like, too quick. This mission will be over too fast for any any cool metal music to appear. We'll have to just chill out with the slightly chiller music, which is fine. It's good music, nonetheless, but I did want to show off the, the sick heavy metal, because it's really fun. I like games that, that do, like, you know, themed music attached to what you're doing, you know? Um, like, j dynamic music is what I mean. Of course, there's, like, themed music attached to what you're doing in every game. Or, like, most games. But I like the, uh, the, dynam the, the dynamic music provided by Quasimorph. I can't speak, dude. I couldn't read earlier today, either. We're just struggling with it. I can't speak now. I couldn't read in Stone Star in Star Sector. Still can't speak, but I'm, I'm just dying, I guess, man. And I, I, I picked up the nails, but we never found any use for them. I thought maybe I'd get a nail gun or something and fire it off a little, but I don't know. Never found it, so I'm putting them down. Do we have cans in our inventory? Hmm. See, I could drink this to drop a little Quasimorph, and then I could, like, stack the cans. Yeah, sure. Hopefully we don't get addicted. All right, no addiction. We didn't even get drunk that time. Let's go. Because getting drunk isn't good. You just lose accuracy. Industrial spare parts. Okay. I can disassemble it. I'm not going to out here, but we'll do it at home, maybe. That seems interesting. I'll take that instead of rubber. Sure. What, is this any good, actually? Feels alcohol and poisoning, general action drugs. I don't know. I don't know how good rubber is. I'll just leave that behind. Oh, smokes. You can get addicted to smokes. Oh, and there's the quest item right there. But you can get addicted to cigarettes now, which is realistic, as you, sh as you should be able to be. Um... But so I don't necessarily want to just smoke them, you know, as freely as we would before. But they're still really good anti-Quasimorph items. They give, like, negative 100 Quasimorph each, if they haven't been changed. Um, and you can stack five of them. And Quasimorph... Oh, it's up to Intrusion now. But um, Quasimorph only goes up to 1,000. And uh, once you get to 1,000, some special stuff happens. Or a special thing happens. I won't, I won't fully spoil that, but... So lowering it by 100 is a lot. Yeah, it's still by 100 down, so... Um, if I could lower it by 100, you know, five times, like a full a full stack of them, that's half the max amount. So it's, it's a big change. Mm, I'll just eat this. I'll stack that, because I, I want to take the smokes with me. And because that's the quest item right there... Um, whoa, oh, they're, they're fighting the Quasimorphs. Let's go. Um, but because that's the quest item, we're, like, pretty much done with the, the mission. I don't really want to spend much of my, like, meds or anything trying to fix up my, my health that's a little brokey. Like, we're, we're pretty much about to leave, so I don't, I don't think we need to. I did just get shoved into the wall by that guy and take some more damage, but... How much damage are we taking? Yeah, we're taking two damage, actually. Um, I'll, I'll bandage that. Two damage per, per like, click, like, per, per action point is a lot, so we'll fix it. I don't want to fix anything else, hopefully, but I fixed that. 
And we'll take the ammo. Mm, I'll drop this. There's no more robots to chop up, so we'll just drop that. And then we put that there, and it saves us two spaces. Because we need one space for that, too. There are some people showing up. Ooh, quasi-morphosis sensor. Sure, sure. I don't know how good it is, but sure, for now. I didn't mean to step, by the way. I should have shot, but I just stepped. Um, I'm going to step away from this guy. Maybe it buys me, like, a turn with without him attacking me. I think it did. I think he could, he could only step forward. Okay. Um, stomach laceration, contusion, bone fracture. All right, we're using more meds than I wanted to use here, but that's fine. It's all right. We'll get a, we'll get, we'll, you know, we'll get away. Ooh. So this is a, a melee weapon that the quasi-morphs have. Um, does 31 to 50 damage, like it's solid damage, severe fractures and good pain damage, like down at the bottom on, on the stats. Um, different weapons have like different, you know, properties like that. So I don't know. It, it, it seems like a good weapon, but I'm just so like, like the backpack space is so limited. Even with a size four backpack, it's pretty limited. We'll drop this. I really want this. We'll drop five. It's just five shots. We can drop five and I'll drop the armor plates. Okay. That's fine. Because I need one more spot again for the quest item. So if I wanted that to end the quest item, I, I figure we might as well make room for all of it right now. And there's some splints on the ground. I can just stack those in my, my current stack, so that's not bad. I only had one left, so I'll take it. Going up to three from one is pretty solid. Whoa! Cloning control system. Defibrillator. Hmm. Just throwing a grenade, because uh, I have too many. I just I don't have too many grenades, but I don't have room for them. There's never too many grenades, but I want this for sure. Can you use that med bay to heal this one in my inventory? I don't think so. Um, I can disassemble it though. I wonder what's up with that. Um, it looks like one of the med bays, but it's called a cloning control system. So I don't know the one placed in the room. Oh yes, this one I can. This one, if the text would show up, this one I can. Yeah, use a heal wound. And then I can use auto dock to heal my health. Thank you for that. I don't pay attention to those a lot. I really should though. Um, that's like, that's a great assistance. What happened to the quasi Oh, he's right there. He was like under the table. Um, but like, I'm really happy to not be under any threat right now as opposed to being like half dead. Is this a new song, by the way? I don't recognize this jam. I, I listen to a lot of the jams in here. I'm not, I'm not recognizing this. I feel like this is new. Which is good. I'm down for new jams. I just did not know. I was not prepared to be treated to such, such wonderful jams. Uh, spider gland. Yeah, it's all right. Go pick it up. Uh, some boots, some jeans. Yeah, it's all right. I, I don't know why I said I'll go pick it up. I meant to say I'll check the container. Sorry, brain broke a little bit there. I will not go pick it up. Okay, so I, we have to figure out one more tile to drop. Um, because I ended up picking up more stuff. Oh, we could, we could just reverse it. How I loaded the ammo earlier, we never got enough ammo, so I can do this, and then this. And now I can take one more stack of something somewhere. I don't know what I want to take, but we can take something. Sure, it's only five shots, but shots are shots. Ammo's good. We'll be back. Okay, quick little mission, dude. Not bad. Again, it was like one star or something, so, you know, it shouldn't have been that tough, but it indeed wasn't. It was a, it was a pretty chill mission, so let's go. Church of Revelation is wrecked. All right, so what did what did they give me? Your quest reward just shows up in here. A very shiny knife. All right. I'm not super pogged about that, but sure. So I'm going to... Well, let me put this stuff away first, because I want to see what this, like, turns into. Um, Alcohol package. That's probably just for barter. Um, Can this be disassembled yet? Can Hmm, maybe I don't want to disassemble this. I'll disassemble this, though. It's called Industrial Spare Parts. Okay, don't disassemble those. That was that was not worth it. I've learned my my lesson right there. Do not disassemble those. That was that was garbage. Okay, so we got um, our shotgun shell. We're down to 55 in reserve. How much how much um, 9 mil do I have? 42. Is this any good? 3% crit chance? 40% piercing? 3% crit chance, 10% knockback. Okay, I don't know. They're, they're similar. I wanted to see if one of these was, like, sp like obviously worse, but they go on different guns, so I just need to figure out which gun's better. 
Like which which ammo type uh, fits into weapons that I more prefer? Because I, I I could get rid of one of these ammos for sure. These rubber rounds, anti crowd munition. Mm, I don't know, man. I just need more shotgun shells. That's the the crux of the issue. I could probably get some from someone somewhere, you know? Like someone would trade them to me. Ooh, these guys want alcohol. Um, SBN wants some alcohol for 113 like trade value. Sure. These guys want PCBs. Oh, and that thing I just broke down. Um, but they also want um <clears throat> that other thing, the quasi morphous sensor. Okay, we can do some trading here. Not a lot of trading, but a little bit of trading. Okay, I'm just looking at different stuff, seeing its value, seeing what's what's worth a lot, what's worth like not a lot. Wait, they also want the servo backpacks for 500? Isn't that what that is? Yeah, yo, hold up. Let's go in here to, to Grasshopper. I want to give him all my servo backpacks. I don't necessarily want to get rid of backpacks. Backpacks are good, but... um. And you normally can't access your cargo while you're in a mission. It's only these missions. Um, a reload duration goes down. Hmm. They're, they're better than I thought. Either way, I don't want to give away all my backpacks in general, but we have these, so I can use those instead of these for now. And 1,500 points could be, like, really good trade value. I could get some stuff that I really want. Also, where do I go for this one? It's off to the right. I always go the wrong direction, man. Um, so we'll, we'll send in some backpacks. These seem to be relatively easy to get, so... And this is, like, a lot of trade value, man. So, yeah, I'm okay with this. Wow, lots of stuff. All of it sucks, except the item chips. Oh, and a chip right here, too. That other chip. I'll talk about that in a moment. Um, so this is all food. We'll take it. It's food. Can I just do this to take all? Okay, I can. But we're full stacked up. Okay, so this is a tack rig. It's, um, it's like my tack rig, but slightly worse. No, no, it gives also a little bit of reload duration. So I guess this gives two cold res, but whatever. Um, it's a rig. That's okay. This is food. It's good food. I do want it. But um, these are item chips. So these will tell me different items. This is the uh, Varangian. This is just an axe. Don't love it. Station stuff full of Snicker bars. I guess so. Medical glue. That's good. This isn't good, but this is good. And then this is um. Oh, the hobo. It's a uh. It's it's a it's a vest, but it's armored. So it, it, that's actually really good. And then this is a class chip. This this red one that I'm not showing off. I'm I'm circling around it here. I'm really hoping it says Tunnel Rats. If this chip says Tunnel Rats, I'm going to be the poggiest pogger to ever pog. I'm going to be really happy. Scouts of Hades. It's one we've already unlocked. Rip. Okay, so that sucks. Um, so that that, that could have been uh, Tunnel Rats, which would have been great. Glue isn't edible. Immersion shattered. No, it's medical glue. Not edible. Not edible. Um, cargo. But so the, the chip is like useless to us, essentially. We, we just trade it back in somewhere that wants it. Um, but there was a chance it was the the, uh, the um, tunnel rats, which is again my favorite class. How much medical? No, 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 no. There's no alcohol in the glue. It is it is like gauze. It is just gauze. Do not drink the glue, please, please, people, stop drinking the medical glue. Um, all right, put this away. All right, we're good to go. And we'll exit. So that was not bad. Lots of food and stuff, um, which is good. You know the Snick picks, the Snickers bars are not the best food, but. We can take in a full stack of 10 and just slam them, you know? Um, and then we can trade off this at the other planets. But where are those where are those chips? Here we go. Uh, unlock chip, unlock chip, and unlock chip. So how much, or what does it take to craft the Vagrant? Or the Hobo, rather, as it's called. Um, this, yeah. Um, so you had a six blunt, six pierce, and then four cold. Not bad for resistances. Um, and it takes... A wire, a rusty metal, oh, and a pathfinder. Can I make pathfinders? I can. Okay, not bad. So we we have a, a decent um, rig to wear. It's not perfect, but it's decent. Um, you know, six blunt and pierce res is not bad, you know? That's, like, decent, so I'm happy with that. And why do we have powder? I thought I didn't have powder. Where did that come from? I have 16. Oh, I got, I got some from that mission. That's where that came from. Duh. Okay. Um, so I can't make this until we get wires and rusty metal. We have some amount of rusty metal, but I don't think we have much. We have six? Okay, not bad. It only takes one, I think, right? Yeah, one. So out of this next mission, we'll try to get, grab wires. I'll try to make sure to bring wires with me. Um, so we got more trading to do for now, though. Oh, and I think I have one of those blue chips. They wanted to trade for 68. Yeah, but it's just one item, and it's just 68, so I'm not going to do it. Um, I'll trade with them for the, the alcohol, though. It's 100. Maybe it'll be something good. Probably not, but maybe. Generally, I think you should try to trade at least a like you know a certain minimum value. 
Um, cause if you trade in like two, like one item at a time, like I'm doing right now, um, you're not going to get anything good. The, like, there won't be enough trade value to give you like the best, the best possible reward. Um, so this is maybe not the best idea. Maybe I should save up like two or three of these before we do this, but have we got a chip? Oh, and you got a, a Starlock 2 single shot pistol. I think that is a shotgun pistol. So I don't know. Not bad. The fact that we got a chip is pretty lucky. I think, uh, finish mission. And what is the Starlock 2? Yeah, it's like a shotgun pistol. It's uh not not good, but we unlocked it at least. You know, we don't have to unlock it later now. And then we wanted to trade here as well. Yeah, they have, they have the or they want the PCBs and the quasi morphosis sensor, I think. So we'll do that. And I'll just put the stuff in here. You could do it at the station or here, it doesn't really matter. Um PCBs and quasi morphosis sensor. Do they have anything else? Or did I have anything else they want? I don't think so. I mean, let me back out, actually, and double-check. Metal plates, but I don't give him my metal plates. Yeah, I don't have anything else, so I'll just give him that. That's fine. Where is he? And he should have the stuff on him still. Yep, okay. Let's go. Send it. And then we're done trading after this. After this, we're going to go um, just back to missions. Back to the real game. Ah, trading's kind of the real game, but whatever. I should check where the thing is, dude. It's the other side, of course. It's always the other side. Fine. All right, what you gonna give me? It's 240, oh no, not those. It's 242, it's not bad. Um, maybe something good? Eh, not really, more food and stuff. I'll take it. These guns aren't any good. I don't I don't like these guns at all. Um, I'm just gonna actually tear them apart right here. We'll take the ammo and the stuff, but I don't want the guns. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. And maybe we can try a little bit tougher of a mission? Maybe not like four or five stars, but like a three star. If I could find a three star mission, I'd be down for sure. Um, and this is the inventory I want. So let's exit. So a little bit of trading. And again, trading is a big part of the game. So let's let's find somewhere to go. Spacecraft. Nope. Wrong thing. Or spacecraft, actually. Do we want to craft anything? Nah, we just don't have anything to craft, really. We, we could technically make this, but I don't want to. I don't think it's that good. System map. We're on Earth. Let's go to here. Anything cool? It's got is it a four-star. I mean, I was saying maybe, but I don't know. Let's, let's try to find a three-star if we could. No? Let's send it then. Let's just send it. Let's try this four star. If we die, our character will reset to level one, which sucks, but whatever, I'll deal with it. I will deal with it. Um We're especially we're playing um What's our class? Scouts of Hades. The Scouts of Hades is a really quick class to level up. These stats to level up. Honestly, all four of these can be leveled up in a single mission. And if you just let yourself get attacked by weak enemies, um, like throughout the mission, because it does have a 50 turn cooldown. Or a 40 turn cooldown? Okay, a 40 turn cooldown. Um, but if you just let let yourself get attacked every so often, these would level up pretty quickly too. So if we die, it's like, you know, I I don't want to die, but it's not the worst thing ever. We can we can live with it. Honestly, there's no death that really is like that big of a deal in, in quasi more. Little sip of the tea there. Little sip of tea. But um generally speaking, you know, any any character you can you can sacrifice. You don't want to. Keeping them alive is obviously better, but you know, if they die, they die. Howdy, partner. Hey, Dom, Dom, Domat Dow? Domat Dow, am I saying that right? I hope so. Welcome on into the yoga dial. Get a bowl, get some fruit, and have a nice little snack. Welcome to you, Domat. I really hope you're enjoying the show today. Thank you so much for following. Welcome on into the yoga dial. Um, oh, I shot their gun. I shot their arm off, so the gun was on the floor. Yeah, uh, do, do, do Mot Dow? Do Mot Dow? Am I saying that right, or is it Do Mot Dow? I struggle with names. Banewind Game. I don't know, so it's like a, it's a Game Boy, I think? But regardless of whether or not I can pronounce your name properly, hello and welcome, I hope you're well. Do I not, oh, that uses that ammo, okay. Yeah, do, okay. Well, do Mot, welcome on in. Welcome to ya. This guy will die eventually. Whoa! Radiation sickness. Whoa! Okay, so this is beam damage. So I guess energy weapons now deal beam damage. They don't do fire, I guess. Or maybe they still can sometimes do fire. Um, I have to find more people streaming this game and really enjoying it. It's a great game. It's a lovely, lovely game. 
Um, I, I was, I was like, you know, waiting for the update to come out since they, since they noted it a couple weeks back, and it's been a really good update so far. So I, I don't, by the way, know what to do about this. I think I'm just like, I'm just sick with radiation poisoning. I don't think there is something I do about that. Like, I think I just like die of radiation poisoning now. I didn't start the reload, no, okay. And I went here to hide for like a turn. It's not, not good, but it was a turn. We're in a lot of pain. Um, I need to deal with the pain immediately. Uh, stomach radiation, calorie can take, sickness chance, damage per AP. I can't fix that though, man. I just put a bandage on my, my, my radiation wound. Ah, this is a, a slightly fun. tougher mission. Hey, I, I mean, Immuneski, Immuneski, welcome on into the yogurt aisle. Thank you so much for the follow. Get a bowl, get some fruit, and have a nice little snack. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, okay, we're chilling, we're chilling. Are you a person? You are a person. Let me just, let me just shoot you. Okay, do a quick reload. Look this way. Ah, there's more. There's a robot. It's fine. It's just a robot. A little snack indeed, indeed. Nom nom. Hope you're doing well, Synthesix. Synthesix, yeah. Synth ah, I'm, I'm just calling you Synthesix. Uh, names are evading me today. I've been struggling with words all morning. Crayon time? No, no, not crayon time. We're not eating crayons. We'll eat, like, some snick picks. No crayons. Sin is fine, too? Alrighty. Oh, just, just land the shot. Jeez, what do you have? Oh, a little blaster. A little shotgun pistol. Are you about to die? Okay, you'll die. Let me just run away. You'll die. It's easier for you. Thank you. I appreciate that. I just got sick, I think. I heard, I heard it. I heard a weird noise. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is my thing broken? It must be. Yeah. Um, let me tear apart their clothes. The, um, ooh, legend boots. I should just put those on instead of mine. The, um, I'll put these here, I guess. The the Pathfinder doesn't have that much health. It breaks, like, a lot. It's pretty annoying. I see that they have not changed that, but I think that's by design. I think it's meant to be rather weak, so. If you get shot a lot, your Pathfinder is going to start breaking, and you don't get access to this stuff down here anymore. So am I, like, taking damage? Damage for AP? How do I fix this? Is there a way to fix the, the radiation? I'll, I'll use a saying beezy, but like, am I just gonna die to radiation poisoning? Like, for real? I don't have any anti-rad medicine on me. Poisoning? I didn't think radiation was poisoning, but I figured, yeah, F, oh, that sucks. I only, I got shot by a blaster once. This guy hit me one time. That's wild. I wonder what I'm meant to do versus radiation. There's, there's got to be like an answer, right? Like, you know, they present a problem and then there's an answer to the problem. There, there must be something. Auto dock can heal it. Ooh, okay. Um, so I think I am done looking for stuff other than the auto dock. Um, I think we're about to be on auto dock journey number one. Um, so I'm gonna start just running around looking for for the auto dock. I'll take this this ammo. And I don't even think I'm going to loot anymore. I think I'm just going to start schmoving. Have I been through a medical place yet? No, okay. See, I'm going to stop looting. I'm just going to start schmoving. Schmoving, that is. Um, look, Looking for an auto dock. And well, we can keep healing. Like, there, there's another one there. A med, a med, ah, a med box, I was going to say. Um, so we can just keep it up. He's one health. I'll shoot this one. I'll full auto. There's, there's the cover in the way. Oh, that's a uh, yeah nail gun. It's really annoying. What do you have? All right. Not as annoying as a nail gun, but it's as or more lethal. Oh, the door got jammed. That's so annoying. When the door gets jammed because I shoot it, it's really annoying. Oh, they had a they they had an energy weapon for sure. They're a scientist. I didn't I didn't see that until after I shot them, but I think I should have um been a little bit more careful about them. I should have taken more care to kill him quickly. Like, used a full auto burst on him. Oh, I said I was going to stop looting, and then here I am. I have, a, I have an addiction to loot, Chad. I can't help it. How are you still alive? That should do it. They should just bleed out. There's the elevator. Hmm. It's, it's like I could either try to... And you're, you're not going to bleed out, by the way. You're still chilling? Okay. I could either try to, like... 
Um, make it happen here. Also, I, I need to reload. That was a really bad time to reload. I can either try to find the med dock here or just hope that the next floor is better for me. Mm, it's a tough call. I shouldn't really search. I'm looking for medicine, but I, I think it's not worth it because it takes a lot of turns. So if there's anyone here, you can get shot off the ledge. So, Okay, yeah. And this is this person probably has a... Oh, no, he just has a shotgun. That's okay. Is anyone up there now? Okay. I'm going to check this because, like, maybe there's something really good in there. I mean, I didn't mean, like, a gun. And the, the shotgun's not even that good. I was hoping, like, for, like, good meds to help, help keep me alive for a while. You know about shooting through walls? Yes, yes. I I do it indeed. Um, I'll shoot through some walls, but I don't, I don't use it too much. I don't think it's, like, that awesome of a tool. It's I think it's kind of niche. Um, this is a solid nade right here. I don't know if you have energy weapons. Nah, just pistols, but still. Good nade. Oh, I blasted the thing. Whatever. Oh, they all died before the nade even went off. Maybe one person down there didn't. Oh, yeah, there's a couple people down there, so. Oh, jeez, they have an energy gun. Okay, the, the door shut, thankfully. Let me reload and hide. Mm, that's really annoying. I I thought they were there. I shouldn't have stepped. I'm playing too fast. I gotta I gotta slow it down a touch. What do you have? Just a gun. Let's just step forward. Yeah. Okay. Shotgun shells. I need to stop medicine loot. I need to stop looting stuff. I need to look for medicine and nothing else. Whoa! I'm up to 84% radiation. I didn't realize that. What if the paramedics have meds on them? Um, they do, but, uh, I think these are scientists, not paramedics. I know they're wearing, like, white coats, but I believe they, they these are not paramedics. Unless you saw someone titled paramedic, in which case they're, they, uh, they might be worth looting. Um, because there are people titled paramedic in the game. I think I have to do that. Are you, are you, like, bleeding out or anything? Yeah, the, the, the fire's done a little bit. Ah, oh, the thing was in the way, are you kidding me? There's no guy title paramedic for which one? Oh, okay, okay, let's go. Um, so I, I might, like, in, in a desperate final attempt, search through him. Just in a blast, so I, I could shoot through the wall and kill him if it worked or whatever, so. There, why are there so many people, man? Oh, and the, I'm shooting the, 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 the wall there. I can't do that. If you stand up next to it, though, it doesn't block you, so. That's the, the, the noise of me getting sick, I'm not used to at all. My weapon's damaged too. Ah, I haven't been getting weapon parts or anything. This is not great. This is not awesome, chat. Auto mode, yes. Just blast him. F yeah, we, we definitely have failed a little bit on this one. At least this nail gun was, was full of ammo for us, but... Need to disassemble some weapons real quick. Repair. Do you give weapon parts? Hopefully. No, you didn't on that one. What is this? Ooh, whoa. medicine? Okay, but it's not It's not what I want. It's not going to heal that. Um, I'll take the buckshot, I guess. And w did I get a... No, no weapon part. Okay. What is this? Mining workwear? No. That's not a, a, an auto dock over there for sure. I shouldn't be auto firing like that. Ah, I'm going full melee runs. They're so much fun. I've never been a huge fan of melee. I just, I, I don't know. I just prefer the shooting. Um, but I do know back when I used to play, I have some other streamer friends that are playing as well. Um, and they, a lot of them like melee as well. So I think that's pretty common to enjoy the melee in this game. It seems it seems to be a, a well-loved feature. But I've never been much of a melee guy. Just throwing up everywhere, man. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Okay, reload this thing. And, like, maybe the, there's an auto docked out here? I don't know. Shoddy plus melee is a great combo. I could definitely see that. And there's some classes, like the, uh, the other starter one. The... Uh, or Scouts of Hades. What is the other one called? I don't know what the other one's called. But they, they are like a little hybrid. You know, they, they give you a bonus with all weapons if you get like a melee kill. So, you know, there's some, some you know, hybridization in there. My meds fell out of my pocket because this is broken. I don't know where. I'm pretty sure I had another med kit. Dang it. That's so sad. 
Okay, let's go full auto. Just get to blasting everything in sight. Okay, we're out of ammo, but sure. Um. Uh, just, just send it. It can't hurt at this point. Drop this. Take this instead. I don't know why I took the ammo out of it, just to, to like, pick it up. We'll go burst, because, oh, we'll reload. I'll go burst, because I just need to kill as quick as possible here. How did you not die? Okay, okay, here we go. Man, why did, these people, I need these people. Oh, Eclipse Blades, thank you. I did forget the name. I need these people to not be here. We got the kill. Just stop appearing, man. Just have less of you be here, please. There's so many of them. They're endless. I should not have done this mission, dude. This mission was too hard for me. It's just an auto-dock, man. Just one auto-dock. A wafer-thin layer of auto-dockery. I've got, I've got a choice to make. I don't think either of these are, are going to save me. I can go one way or the other. You know what I could do, actually? I could get a little regen from eating. I should have been doing that before. Um, that's something. Maybe? I mean, we're, we're gaining health. I did, I did get, yeah, I'm gaining health instead of losing it now. Let me just reload while the door is shut. Stop shooting me, please. You know what? I don't have nades, no! I'll hide behind cover. I'm down to 11 health. Um, I think I die. I think I'm dead. I'm not even really checking what, what I need to do there. I'm just putting stuff on. They didn't die. They're gonna shoot me. Okay, they, they didn't shoot me because they hit the wall. Okay! I need to stop going burst. I need to... I'm out of ammo? Just pick something up. Thankfully, we... Oh, God. That's a very, like... Why are they shooting each other? That's, like, a very violent gun he had. Um, which is, like, an oxymoron. All guns are violent, but whatever. Uh, all my armor is broken. I'm out of meds. Uh, I think this is it. How many skulls is the mission? I think it was four. I think it was four. Did you imagine they will heal you? Yeah, I didn't... I didn't, um, realize that until, like, I just did. That's actually kind of pog. But I believe this was a four skull. Which I, I, you know, I was under the impression I was not prepared for, but I wanted to try it. I also didn't mean to reload. That was a misclick. Ah, no. Okay, we tried. We tried. That's fine. We gave it our best. For a four skull, I can, I can call that, you know, fair enough. So again, we're back to level one. Everything we earned on that character is gone. Both the loot on the character is gone and the skills we gained from doing the mission. So we're back to being a little basic Bobby, but that's okay. That is, that's fine. That's the nature of the game. You will reset to, to level one frequently. That is, that is just, uh, you know, that is just quasi-morph. Um, okay, two star, civil resistance, and SBN's the beneficiary. And I like SBN. They, they naturally are up near the top. Like, they're already powerful. They're relatively high tech. Um, every, everything about them is good, in my opinion. So let's go and let's go and do that. And that mission is much, much likely to, much more likely to be doable. Um, again, because it, it's, oh wait, no, wait, four skulls? No, 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 no. Where was it at? All of my buttons? Hmm? Where was that mission? Is it here? Did I misclick or something? Am I insane? Did the mission vanish before my very eyes? Mars, I think? Oh, it was on Mars, but that's 15 days away. I, I, I meant to click Fuller, and I guess I clicked Mars. Okay, that's annoying. We can't, we can't do it. Um, and it's not like I, I don't want to do it. It's like literally I can't travel there before the mission's over. The mission will be over in eight days, and it's 15 days to travel there. So, rip. What we might have done, we cannot. But this one I can. It'll take me a week to get there, but it's going to be up for uh, 14 days. But I will not do this mission. Why I'm refusing this mission is the beneficiary is Texclon. Um, and Texclon are the aliens. Um, and I don't want to help them because they naturally will become powerful, very powerful, if you don't actively fight against them. So if you help them, they'll become really powerful really quickly. And why they get so much power is they do two missions a week. Every other corporation gets one mission a week. They get two. So they, they in theory, have a chance of collecting or like gaining two stations per week and stuff like that. So 
Um, they will they will already become quite powerful on their own. They don't need my help. I want to actually try to keep them, you know, check, in check. They're they're kind of the big baddie. So I don't want to do this mission. Um, oh, and it's not here. It's in here. I don't want to do uh, this mission. Whatever it was, this one. Yeah. Um, we could do it, one difficulty, all that stuff, but I don't want to help Dexclon. So we'll, we'll look for something else. And there's this. This would fight against Espion and its four skulls, so no. What about this one? Two skulls? Four Ancom against Grasshopper? Perfect. Sure. And it's a conquest, so. Um, let me see if there's anything for me to craft, actually. No, we died. We didn't get anything. Never mind. Um, but so, if we win this mission, or I'll say with confidence, when we win this mission, we will, uh... Not we, but SBN or ANCOM. ANCOM, I think, is the, the beneficiary. They will take the, the place, and they'll have an extra station, which means they'll get more science and power and stuff. They'll, they'll tech up more quickly. Oh, whoa. This wasn't here before. Is that you? I remember you. I've been waiting, hoping that you would show up again. And here you are. You've come to close. You've come close enough to Ganix for my call to reach your mind. But this proximity is not, uh, is not enough for us to make a pact. Do not fear. It will be beneficial for both of us. We have something to offer each other. Do you know why Quasimorphous occurs in the Solid Realm? Why the barons come to you? To meet me? Go to, uh, oh, why they come to you? To meet me, go to Venus and simply do your job. Massacre them the way, uh, the way you always do. Murders, cannibalism, people screaming in agony. I will sense the sweet aroma of Gavok and I will know it's you. And I will come to you in person, then, in person, and we'll discuss the terms of our alliance. Um, nah, I don't think I want to do this. Um, you can make packs with the aliens. Um, they used to suck, but apparently they've been made better. Previously, the packs were just terrible. They would just get you killed. Um, they, they actually couldn't be used, but now I've heard that they're better. Um, so we'll have to, we'll have to see, but I, I probably won't do that for a while. I, I want to, again, I want to get like my legs under me before we do that. So we're just going to go back Percy, kind of boring or whatever, doing the same guy in class, but that's fine with me. I, I think it's very good. So we did lose one of our good backpacks there, but I think we can, we can afford to bring in another one. I don't think we'll lose this one. And we had good armor too, which is just gone now. I have to wear like blue jeans. That's, that's embarrassing. We're wearing a weird helmet, blue jeans, and a jacket into into battle. That is not what you want to see. Well, the gladiator, sure, I don't know. And then, um, oh, we don't have very much shotgun ammo. Because I, uh, I didn't have much before, and then I took it in and lost it. We're pretty low now, so. I might bring in an SMG instead. We, we don't have many shotguns, and we don't have much ammo, so it's probably time for something else. Oh, we have this emergency supply thing. Um, I forgot about that. It gives you, like, a little bit of basic gear, a gun, and stuff. What ammo is that? This ammo? Sure, sure. Because I need to stack it up anyways, so sure. Um, I'll take this stuff out. I'll take all this out, honestly, and we'll just we'll, we'll choose what we want on our own. Unrelated to that. But I'm happy it gave me some free stuff. I'll take free stuff. So I'll take a little more ammo. That's probably enough. I can pick up 9 mil pretty commonly in the raid. Like, there will be lots of enemies with it, I'm expecting, so. And we got an eagle from the, the box as well. But yeah, I'm expecting that to be enough on ammo. We'll take a stack of food. And some meds. Where, where are my sorbents at? We should have a bunch of sorbents. There we go. Three, that's enough. And I'll take one of these. I've never used these mines, really. Sure. Oh, you can't put them down there? I guess you use them out of the inventory. Sure, I'll, I'll bring a mine, though. And we need, uh, not antibiotics, but splints and bandages. Do we really have none? Wow. Okay, can I craft those? Hold up. Are those craftable? How do you make a splint and a bandage? Okay. Okay, sure, I'll make five of each. Wait, I can only make one? Oh, because I only have one plastic. Okay. So we need we need to uh, get some plastic for, for splints, too. I didn't realize they took plastic. Um, so that's okay. We'll, we'll craft those. My character doesn't really have enough meds to go in, like, happily, but we'll make it work. It's enough meds to not explode immediately, so we'll make it work. I might bring in another med pack just in case. Um, this, will, this will just give me, you know, a little bit more medicine, so I don't have to rely just on those. And we have three sorbents. We shouldn't get infected more than three times. Um, we don't have enough medicine, you know. To, if we get infected more than three times, we're dead. And I'm going to bring in ten snick picks instead of these. Just, they're not great food. Honestly, ten of ten of these is not worth five of these. But I need to eat them because they're just taking up space. So we will. I'll bring these in just because there's something a little extra. Just in case we run out of food. I don't know how, how, like, uh, how many floors this mission was. I could have checked, but I didn't. But if it's like a lot of floors, then, you know, we'll need lots of food. But if it's only like two floors, we won't eat all this stuff. But it's, you know, it's a little wasteful if we like, you know, throw it down or something or just you know, leave loot behind because we're taking it instead. But that's fine. You you can never be perfect. Ooh, a nano stem. Heals shock, negative 80%. And then everything else, too. 
Does it heal radiation? Heals radiation wounds. Okay. That seems like really pog. Um, but that's a, you can get nano stims as like a reward from someone. I remember seeing it on the other, uh, the, the like quest rewards. So I maybe want to get my hands on those because apparently radiation sickness is terrible. An item chip. Let's go. Um, again, that's an, uh, the item chips are valuable enough that they, they will let me finish the mission uh, just for finding that. And it could be something like particularly valuable for my whole playthrough. That's OP healing item. Yeah, it's, I think that's that's what it's meant to be is like the super OP item. And I'm happy it's there. I'm happy it exists. And I should break the gun down. And I should honestly take some like armor out of here. And these don't do anything. Do these help? Yeah, they're, they're kind of good. Um, but I should I should get a little bit of armor. Um, <clears throat> I think we had another pair of boots at home, but I'll take these anyways. I'll drop that just because it's one thread. But I'm going to try to stack like another set of armor up. So if we die, it's not like the worst. Smuggler, makeshift armor. Okay. Smuggler armor used to not be very good. Maybe it's a little better now. But even though I can leave with that item, I don't think I'm gonna. I'm gonna stick with the mission and try to finish it. Um, or at the very least, just try to get like as much loot out of this mission as I can before we leave. Um, if it was a really good armor, I would have been certainly out of here. You know, it would have been like, let's go, or a really good item, I mean. Um, didn't necessarily have to be an armor. But if, it, if the chip was very pog, we'd be leaving. But it's not that good. At least from my understanding, it's not that good. Maybe, maybe it's been changed and it's amazing. But I feel comfortable just finishing the mission. Because if you leave every time you find any item, you can spend a lot of time just doing the same mission over and over. So I try not to just spam leave too much. Oh, my pants are already broken. That's annoying. Um, I'll just put on these instead. I guess that works out pretty well. And we'll unload the ammo. I'll disassemble. Take the ammo. I don't, I don't want that short pipe. I don't really need these noodles either, though. And this is 9 mil ammo, but it's, like, explosive or something. Um, it has a better crit chance than it deals cut type. I don't know if this does cut. Yeah, it deals blunt normally. So it does a different type of damage. It has bonus damage, and it has a really high crit chance. So um, it's it's great ammo. It's much better than the base ammo. I'm going to go ahead and just use this on that there. Because I both I needed to, and I wanted room for this thing. The management unit. I don't know what it is, but sure. Seems cool. I think I saw it as a trade item, so I'll pick it up and try to trade it. Another splint. You love to see it. Oh, and the plastic. We need that. That's needed for splints now, so I absolutely need it, even if I have enough food. Ooh, this is a really good room. The downside is you get knocked into Narnia, like you can just die, but you get two little treasure chests here. If you're willing to walk across the like the very scary you know area right there. Um, I don't. Have, I didn't pick up either ammo. I'm now realizing. Okay, I can't, I, if I use that, it'll be wasteful, so I won't use the other one. I really want the shotgun shells, but I think we're just going to leave them behind. Same for this ammo. I want this ammo too, but we'll just leave it. If I don't have space for it, then I don't have space for it. Oh, wait, let me see. Does it tell you what items you can jump with? Does it tell you what items you can jump with? What, um, what, do, you, what do you mean when you say jump with? Do you mean like leave? Like what items you're allowed to leave the mission with early? Um, sorry, I missed that message a little bit. Yeah, um, it, it tells you at some point, but it's the chips. It's uh, the, the mine chip, the item chip, and the, the the class chip. Only those. I believe there's no other items. Um, I it, it, it tells you somewhere, I'm pretty sure, too, but I don't know where, and I definitely didn't read it. I skipped over the message um, whenever it showed up. Whoa, you're, I forgot we're on Texcalon. Um, so on Texcalon... There are the, the Texclon aliens, or no, we're on Venus, excuse me. On Venus, there are the Texclon aliens, and these are my favorite aliens to fight. They're really scary, but you can chop up their bodies for good stuff. I think they nerfed it and made it so that if you chop up these guys' bodies, you don't get really good stuff anymore. Um, but they still have, like, better loot than the other aliens, for the most part. And you have a melee weapon. Okay, that's fine. I'll go ahead and reload while you're chilling up there. So this alien, I do want to chop his body up. I just want to check. Do they give human parts now? Yeah, I thought they did. So they nerfed it. They give human parts now. They used to give alien parts. But I can still chop up their clothing. Um, and it's it's like alien armor. So you can get these bits that are really good. These used to be the best trade item in the game. Um, you would you would stack these up to an insane amount. And you could I traded in like a million trade value one time. Um, now they're just good medicine or whatever. They used to be good medicine too. Um, like the medicine part never changed, but they used to just be insane for trade value. I'm assuming that they nerfed that and they're um, They're no longer right, not even assuming they nerfed it back when I used to play 
Um, I can guarantee they nerfed that, and it's no longer good for trade. It's still decent. If you can stack up a bunch of these, it can still be okay for trade. Or at least it used to still be okay for trade. But it wasn't it, it wasn't the most OP thing ever like it was for a while. And we'll take that. Are these better? Yeah, these are better for sure. And these legend boots are better than these, so I'll take those. And we'll put this on because it's better. Okay, little little improvement there. I'll take it. And this shotgun should have ammo in it. Yep, so we're we get, trying to get a full stack. It's not bad. And then disassemble. Maybe we'll get another thing. We did. Let's go. Let's go. And there's these. Um, to repair the alien armor, you need this. Um, or it's, it's not even just alien armor. It's the Venus armor. Um, so there, if you want to wear alien armor, it's, it's tough to actually repair it. You used to be able to repair it with anything, but they've made it tougher. And you used to wear the alien armor a lot to fight the, the aliens. The Venus armor tends to have a lot of cold res, which is what damage the, these weapons do. Um, this does cold damage. So, um, if you didn't want to die to the aliens, you really needed to wear their armor. Um, but they've, they've nerfed it, it seems. It seems like it's a little tougher to just use their armor against them. It's probably still a good idea if you have the repairs to wear their armor, but I think a little bit less of a good idea than it once was. And we're just looking for the elevator. It'll, it'll show up somewhere. There we go. Speaking of the elevator, it's right there. So we'll loot these guys just to see if they have, yeah, like some food or something. Oh, wait, there's a person right here that walked up. They quasi-morphed into an alien with a melee weapon, too. Okay, and maybe another stack. Let's go. Um, and again, I can't use this for the sicko trades, like the insanely high-value trades, but it's I'm still happy to find it. It's a good medicine. I don't think it, like, burns away. Or, oh, yeah, spoils after two days. Never mind, I'm wrong. It does burn away. You can't stack it up. So it's not as good as I was saying. Um, in, in two days, this will turn into nothing. And it will, I can't use it for, like, meds or trade or anything, so... I, I sh Oh, my weapon's damaged. I, uh, will repair, that's fine. But I shouldn't be as excited about those things as I am. Because, uh, I, can I can't really use them. Like, after I leave the mission, they, they'll just die. I forgot they did that. But it, it's for the best, again. They were really, really overpowered. Just using that for, like, everything was, was too strong. Powder? Mm, it's literally one, so I'm not gonna take it. And we did find the elevator, but I wanted to do just a touch more of exploring on this floor. We're back up to intrusion. And this weapon's solid. It shoots like poison at people. Um, it used to be like bad, but they made it better. It's silenced. It does like decent damage. It has good crit. So I don't know. It's not a bad weapon, but I don't think I'm going to pick it up. There is a, a Kim, like a, a, a weapon that spits poison like that, but it's like a flamethrower. It's like a Kim thrower. That I want to get my hands on. That seems pretty solid. I'm just going to do something I haven't even talked about. You can shut a door and then lock it. So now they can't walk through there. They have to shoot through there, which I don't think they're even going to try to do. Oh, they are. They're breaking it down. They, enemies used to not break through doors like that. That's cool. Um, are they chasing me still? I think they are. Yeah. That's really cool. They used to not do that. Oh, it's a it's a new alien. This is a, The other ones were slaves. This one's an acolyte. Um, so he's a little bit more threatening. Acolytes aren't that threatening, but more threatening than the other ones. And it has poison res, cold res on the helmet. Nothing too special, but it's, it's an okay helmet. There's a different helmet that's that's a lot better. If I got if he had that on, I might want to take it. But that one's, you know, just fine. We'll take that instead of that. And um, do I want this armor? Nah, it's, it's pretty bad stuff. I'll leave it behind. Oh, but I really should go through and break down like every gun. Because my gun's about to break. Uh, they have no guns? It's all melee weapons? No! Um, I need a, I need a weapon part for my gun. But if we, if we can't get anything for my weapon, we can just leave. I did pick up the item chip, so I can just leave. Stove, do I have anything to cook? Nah. Oh yeah, I forgot you can cook skin now. Um, it's weird, but you can. Oh, I, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know whose decision that was, but it was someone's decision. There's some food there for me, but I don't need food. I need a gun, which actually, it's not a bad gun, and we have some shotgun ammo there, so. I'm like, mm, maybe. We'll drop the Baron Fill, which I don't think we need. And, um, or Baron Fennel. I keep calling it Baron Fill. Drop the Baron Fennel and something else. We can just get rid of the knife for now. If I, if I need to chop anything up, we can. But that helps. We can use that while we're looking for a, a weapon repair thing. Yummy human skin. Yeah, I, 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 the game is like psycho with it. 
We, the game is a, 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 a strange world these folks live in. Didn't take much damage there. He's got good armor. I didn't think he was going to take much damage. I'll blast him once more. I'll just hide. I'll go back to single shot. He should be dead yet. Yeah. Whoa, there's a lot of people here. This is, this is not good, chat. This is, ooh. Very cold. Incoming damage plus 20. Running is unavailable. That's cool. I'm going to move down like this so that they have to walk in a line to get to me. I took like a free turn of shots, but it's okay. Okay. And I think the cold is just going away on its own? No? Maybe? Yeah, yeah it's going away. Okay. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these these cloths, which is gonna make the the the, the quasi morphing go up. But I want to use them. We have them. Um, they they they're good medicine. So I'm gonna go ahead and just use them. So the quasi morph's gonna go up. It's up to 582. You might hear some new jams now. Um, but it's it's the meds I had. We have other meds, but not not many. So I didn't want to just like burn through them too willy nilly. So I'm not stoked to have used that medicine, but it is what it is. I'm not too upset with it either. I felt we had to, so I did. And I'm going to eat this stuff so I can take this ammo. I don't have many guns that use this ammo, but when I do get a gun, like one or two good guns that use that ammo, I'll be very happy that I'm stockpiling it right now. Future me will be happy that me right now is, is stockpiling a boatload of that ammo. So I'm going to keep doing it. It, it, is, it is good for the long run. You know, it's taking up space in my inventory and not giving me anything right now, but in the long run, it'll be really worthwhile. Probably shouldn't have stepped in there. Whoa. What? Oh, I must have been shot by someone. Because I'm cold again. Frostbite? Hmm. These heal frostbite? Yeah, heals frostbite. Okay. I frostbite on three different spots, though, and I have one bandage. I really don't want to use, like, I don't want to keep spamming these. Self healing scratch? The frostbite's not, though. I just, I'm like, that's too much Quasimorph. We're good. The boss is going to be summoned soon. Yeah, the music's turned fully insane. Oh, jeez. Yeah, so the, the very scary enemy has showed up. I'm leaving chat. I'm getting out of here, chat. I think it's time to go. I'm going to try to kill that guy. Is he going to walk through? I guess he doesn't know I'm here. Yeah, seeking, so he doesn't know I'm here, I think. Okay, he found me. There we go. I wanna I wanna see how much damage can I do to this guy? Could I kill him? Actually, yeah, okay, okay. Because he might drop an item. Nah, I was hoping he would drop a cool item. Hmm. I'm pretty sure we're gonna die, but I think I'm gonna stick around and fight the boss. Uh it's it's almost summoned. I, I didn't explain it earlier, but now that we're here, I should have put more hype on it or whatever, but. Um, the boss summons at a thousand. So I think we're gonna stick around and fight the boss. The only downside with that is, um... I thought that was gonna explode based on the noise, by the way. Um, oh, we're more chest pain. Eh, whatever, fine. So, oh yes, I'm coming. The agony, the cries of the dying, pain leaving your bodies with the blood. All this in the solid realm looks very different inside Ganix. Um, to us it is a sweet-voiced cry, a choir of ecstasy. Gavok flows out of your bodies with blood, torment and life itself. It streams through your realm and seeps into ours. We can drink it. Talt, talt noms crave Gavok. Talt noms want Gavok. Gavok gives us power. Once we are satiated with Gavok, we can tear through the invisible fabric, se separating our realm from yours. First we whisper to you, then we tempt you, then we change you. And finally, when you have been turned into our servants and Gavok is flowing, we can reveal ourselves. We do not lose our immortality. Our death in Kenom is merely an exile back to Ganix. So when you killed me on Mercury, I did not die. Accept my gift, and we will make a pact. You will become my servant. I will become the. Uh, I will give you power to resist Texclon and protect the Solid Realm, your realm. Now finish the job you came here for. I will help you. Um, that that sounded like he was gonna help me. I'm pretty sure he's gonna kill me. Um, and when the boss gets summoned, um, all the enemies on the map know where you are. They they start like chasing you down. Yeah. So I think I think enemies are just gonna like show up here. Yeah. Do we have a lot of ammo? No. Hmm. I wanted to fight, but now I'm actually looking. We, we don't have ammo to fight. I'll, I'll stick with it. I'll stick with it for a little while. How weak are you? Are you going to bleed out? Lots of damage. 
Yeah, like two there. Damage for AP, damage for AP. Two, three, like four, five. Yes. I don't need to shoot you anymore. I can save on ammo. Yeah, 11 HP. Yeah, he'll die. He'll die. Okay. I mean, we have some ammo. This this weapon's be like almost broken is bad. Oh, no. I shouldn't have walked out there. Okay, okay. It's fine. I mean, we're killing these things, but I just, I'm out of ammo. I'm really, really low on ammo. I need to step out and get, like, guns off these people if this is gonna work. I have to have something. I mean, there's this. Um, I don't want to end up using that, but it's, it's, it's a gun. Like, it exists, you know? If we have to, we have to. And I don't think we can kill the boss, but you know, we're here and you know, we're not super high leveled or anything. <gasps> and I have Korok, okay, cool. These are really good. They reveal the whole floor. And I think right now, oh no, the signal's lost, Never mind. Um, when the whole, fl whole floor gets revealed, I'm pretty sure you can actually see where the enemies are, but only for like a few turns because they move. Oh God, it's the boss. Um, their hand is called No. Deals 30 crit damage, or it's 20 damage, 30 on crit. Range of three, accuracy of 60. Are you gonna bleed out? Yeah, I'm just gonna assume you're gonna bleed out. Okay. I re I just started reloading my, I reloaded my weapon on accident. Okay, we might be able to do this. Oh no, indeed. Now, is it normal, is it, is it, is it will help you look away from her? Wait, really? Oh wait, so she wasn't kidding? When she said like, I, I can finish my job and she'll help me? But I don't want her to. I don't wanna make a pact with this Texclon alien. Um, am I meant to do this for, like, like the story? Can I just kill her? I thought we were fighting. She's, like, messed up, too. I think I want to kill her. I blasted her, but she nice? She's only nice because she wants to, like, use me for, for her own gains. Um, so this is a, uh, oh, you can get addicted to Gavok? That's cool. Used to, this used to not have an addiction. But this is the greatest of quasi-morph dropping items. It drops it by 600. Do whatever you want. Okay, okay. I was hoping I would get a pact. Did they change how you get packs? Like, how come I didn't get a pact for killing her? Previously, when you killed the boss, they would drop a pact. Um, Reduce Somnia back to nothing. Yes, yes. After you kill the boss, it reduces it to zero. It, it refreshes it every single time. So I could kill the boss like over and over, I think, if I really wanted to. Oh, there's a Gavok here, too. Or an Idol. All right, I'll take it. Oh, they don't stack. I forgot. Sure, content, you'll get her packed after the mission. Okay, okay, let's go. Ooh, just a nade launcher. Um, there's too much stuff. I'll drop that. Sure, put this up here, and I'll take these, and then this. Let's send this on another nade launcher, maybe. No, but a good weapon. I think it just fires nine mil. Oh no, it fires seven six, uh, like seven six nine or whatever it is. Seven seven nine seven. Okay. Um, I'd rather have this than this then, sure. And we, it, when this breaks or whatever, we'll, we'll get rid of it. So let me let me do the thing where I reload the, the gun. Just so we have more room for ammo in here. It helps a lot. It actually makes a solid difference. So do that. Okay, okay, we're chilling. And then all the dead bodies that are here are from uh, the, the aliens showing up and like fighting each other. Like the aliens exploded out of these guys' bodies and then um, they, they, they killed the robots and stuff. Oh, I'm my foot's broken. I did. I was just dying. I didn't realize it. Also, we're pretty hungry. Ate a bunch of Snickers. She did an insane snack of Snickers. There's just 20 of them. You know what? Do you? I don't know what are you gonna do. It's what we got. It's what we're eating. It's probably not the best for me, but it's what we got. Is this the elevator to go down? Wait, evac. Oh no, is that? That's because I clicked the item. I think. Yeah, Valley. Okay, yeah, I don't... Oh, I don't... Are, are we done here? I don't think we are, right? Demon curse to grab a Snickers? Yeah, I guess so. Don't forget to some guns. Yours. That is that is true. I forgot, honestly. I was paying attention to it earlier, and then I just forgot. Um, I probably stepped over some guns. I even remember seeing a pistol. Well, we'll get back in, like, the meta of stuff like this. We'll get, like, more and more, like, you know... Familiar with doing stuff like this again. Eventually. I don't know when, but eventually. This is a symbol. No weapon parts. Alright, whatever. It's fine. I didn't want any weapon parts. I was just testing. 
Okay, we, we got 34 of these. That's not bad. Is this armor better? No, but I kind of want it. I, do. I need armor, so I kind of want it. Um, we'll drop an idol. We don't need the idols. They, they drop Quasimorphous, but... They used to be really good, but now that they spoil in two days, they're not as good. I, I don't think I need either of them. I'll keep one just in case, but I don't really think I need them. Ooh, a serpent's mouth. It's a, it's a proper rifle. It's it's the, the alien rifle. Not bad. You don't get weapon parts, right? Yeah, they give you the, the these things, which don't repair normal weapons. They repair the alien weapons. Oh, it... Wait... I mean, let me let me go through here. The mission might actually be over. over here. I, I I wish you could tell once you've clicked the button. Oh no, it's not. There's floor three. So I should have checked their stuff. I should I should go back. Um, do we have? Yeah, we have we have like enough food to go on for sure. We have enough food, not enough anything else to to go back for sure. Ooh, thirteen or eighteen thirty six. Oh, this is worse than this. Did they buff this? I feel like this was a better version of this before. I'll take this, though. Two ammo on the ground. Yeah, it is what it is. So let's go back to floor two and search those bodies. We probably won't search all of them, but we'll search some of them. And we're healing. Yeah, we're fine. We're chilling. We're chilling. Nope, not equipped. Disassemble. And this guy. What is brigand armor? Yeah, not good. Disassemble. We'll eat the food. Disassemble. Our backpack's almost broken. Um, I should fix it up. Let's repair, and I should repair that thing, too. But I don't know how much health the, the other thing has, but you can tell this thing has way more health because it was, like, not dead yet. We got shot a lot, and it didn't die, so... Um, it is it is a lot tankier than the other one. Hmm. Are there, like, armor repair kits off those? Yeah, let's go repair. This isn't armor? What do you repair that with, then? With cloth? No shot. Rusted metal, maybe? No, not stabilize wound. What do you repair boots with? I, I tried everything. Armor plate, rusted metal, and this. Oh, no, plastic? No. Or rubber? No, though. Either way, whatever it is, it's, it's not what you repair with. Okay, I don't know how to repair my boots, but I don't know. Worst things have happened. Legend says it. Oh, I forgot. There's like, there's like heavy armor. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. That makes sense. I need to I need to get the proper like armor type. Fair enough. I'm just gonna go ahead and swap these. Two shots is not enough. Rapid fire for four or burst for two. Two shots is probably enough, and I want to be conservative with my ammo, so. And we're back to hundred quasimorphs, so the aliens are showing up again. And they don't show up if you're under hundred quasimorph. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier, but under hundred when Somnia is going on, there's no aliens. You're completely free of the alien invasion. And we'll of course take all the ammo we can. Um I should oh, I should disassemble this. Disassemble, disassemble. Weapon part repair. And metal. Nah, I, sh I really want these, but I don't know. Well, I, don't, I just don't know what I need to take. But I'm taking this ammo. Ammo's good. We can turn it into, like, even if I don't use this ammo, I can turn it into powder. So I'll take the ammo for sure. I'll just get a one nade. It's one grenade. We can live out without one grenade. Defibrillator, probably a good thing, but... Wait, dis disassembled into nothing? It turned into nothing? What? All right. Oh, didn't I want one of these? No, I wanted wires. It's it's called the wire, but it's, it's a lie. What I want is called wire, not the AKA the wire. And I to get them, I could chop up robots. I totally could actually be getting um the the wires that I want to make the uh, the good armor, the good tack rig. So I'll chop up this robot. You're really not gonna die. Two HP, you'll die. You'll die. You'll bleed out. Okay. I just need a sharp weapon. Okay. Oh, my chest is broken. That's fine. Ah! Where did you come from? So what are you holding? Was that just a metal pipe? Okay, yeah. Um, so I'm not gonna use... Whoa, what? What was that noise? Oh, this guy shot the door or something. Okay. That, that, that noise threw me off. Again, they used to not break through the doors. Oh, jeez, man. Leave me alone. Oh, he has no weapons. He's just chilling. I've never seen one without weapons. They used to always come in with a sickle, at least. This little, this little thing here. Uh, I heard someone walk. Okay. Are you almost dead? Not really. 
I just, I'm just trying to chop up that robot so I can go get my gun back. Can y'all stop shooting me? Ah, the weapon's damaged. Whatever, it's melee time. Send it. Send it. Stab him. Come on, stab him. There we go, there we go. Take some ammo for my other gun. Then I'll disassemble this bad boy. Ooh, alcohol. Um, Do I want it right now? Do I want to use it? It gives a lot of calories. I hope I don't get addicted. Let's just hope. Yeah, no, we're not addicted. Just, just very drunk. Not addicted, just drunk. Okay. Where's the robot, by the way? I forgot I was here to chop up a robot. AR corpse, there we go, there we go. So I'm looking for wires. One, I got one, I got two PCBs and a wire. Weapon repair kit. Hmm. Eat that, get rid of that for that. Just drop this, take the ammo. It's two shots. I don't even think I'm gonna take the ammo, but whatever. Um, but that's fine. I think this is fine. And again, the wire makes the hobo, which is good. I want the hobo. So we'll take that and we'll drop that. All right, this is it's going. It's going all right so far. Maybe not perfectly, but we're, we're not dead. Military first aid kit. What is that? Is that like a sick med? Whoa! Can you disassemble? No. Okay. Heals infection, poisoning, heals all wounds, regen 20, turns active 4 AP. Yo, that's like sick. Hmm. I'll take it instead of those five shots. That's really cool. I've never seen that before. Very good item. Yeah, it seems like amazing. Is this rapid fire? Okay, yeah. They shot me with, I'm pretty sure, a shotgun pistol. Yeah. It's annoying, but it's not that big of a deal. Like, it's not that powerful. Um... I'm just gonna use one of these. That heals everything, right? Yeah, we're chilling, we're chilling. Oh, robot. The old robot. Oh, what? Mission management? I don't know what my mission was, but it's done, so. It was probably clear half half of each floor. I don't know. Um, it, it started glowing, so the actual job got done. Um, it's still saying this is a valuable item you can leave with it, but the, the real job got done. Whoa. I'm just gonna do this. I, even if they hit me, I just didn't want to take a risk of shooting this and exploding. This. I was trying to shoot them, but it didn't work. I didn't think it was going to work, but I wanted to try. And I need a sharp weapon again to chop up the robot. The old robot. Maybe the robot has one on him. Maybe this. There we go. There we go. Uh, lifter, take the ammo, disassemble. Ammo? Where'd the ammo go? I guess I picked it up. I don't know. Hey, our corpse. Chop this stuff up. Five wires. Let's go, dude. That's a lot. We only got one off the last one, so four off that one's pog. Um, oh, shots. Or people. Dude, how are you not dead? You're not even, like, hurt? Got some thick armor, dude. That's some really thick armor you got there. You should bleed out. Yeah. There's a shotgun in there, so I want to grab it. Let's see what he's got. Yeah, shotgun ammo. Oh, my backpack's broken. Uh, swap these. And tear this stuff apart for cloth. No! my I need cloth. I, my stuff's just going to fly everywhere. You really don't have anything else, brother? Just to assemble this? No, I can't because it's like broken. Okay, let me just go. I'll just eat. Oh, I'm bleeding to death. Wow. Um, let me just use that. It's a little waste, but whatever. I, d I almost died just because I was being very, like, negligent of my own health bar. That's not good. That is not a great way to almost die, let me tell you. So, repair. And we're getting out of here. So, I just need to repair once and then pick my stuff up and we're leaving. Um, I guess I'll take that. Legend boots. Oh, I want those. What did we have? Can I put that down here? Can I put this down here? Okay, let's go. And then... Nothing there. Well, maybe something there. I checked the manager, but not the floor. Okay, nothing there. Okay, the shotgun. Unload the ammo. Okay, there we go. I should disassemble it. We have an empty slot, so I might as well take a weapon part or something. Okay, I hope I'm not missing something cool. I hope I didn't, like, lose something. I know we dropped, or we didn't drop. We used our med kits, so that's that should be, like, that, that empty is fine. Everything else in here seems normal. I had two pair of boots before, but I think I just chose to leave one behind. No, I didn't. Not for a plastic. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, that seems good. So, uh, I'm getting out of here. Where's the elevator? 
Where, oh, where? Okay, there we go. It's right there. Not bad. We made it out, dude. I'll take it. Not bad at all, dude. Ah, uh, we're not out yet. I punched him with my gun, so it broke. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, okay. We should be safe. We should, there's, there's no way, right? There's no one in here. Okay, let's go. I'll take this ammo. We couldn't take it before, but we got room now. Okay, that was a bloody mission. Jeez Louise. I am, I'm like stunned we got that done, but let's go, dude. I gathered you this, I, I granted you the skull of the feathered serpent so you could only, so that you could make a pact with me. It is already on the way to your ethereal ship. Okay. Oh yeah, it's right there. It's the pact item. Okay. Um, I'll, I'll look at it in one moment. So let me, let me do this. I just want to sort my inventory a little bit first. Uh, I'll just keep the SMG, put this thing away, put the shotgun ammo away, put all this away, that, that, the wires. This thing's gonna spoil in two days, or in a, a day and six, or a day and 16 hours, but I guess I'll hold it then. I, just, I don't think we need it, but whatever. We'll organize. I want a little more ammo for this. Yeah, it's fine. It's a lot of ammo, but it's okay. We'll take the snick picks. They were fine food. They worked out. I'll take the other medicine that totally exists somewhere. I thought I got a bunch of bandages. Did I not make bandages? Oh, they're just not craft yet. Okay. I'll make more than that too. Um, so let's, let's go into the, oh, we got a fighter backpack. That's a, not a bad reward. But let's go into the inventory. Let's look at what this pack does. So I, I don't believe this existed before. Chosen hostile human will become an ally for 10 turns. Dodge reduced by 200% for 20 turns. Quasi-morph penalty, uh, 200, and you can only use it every 50 turns. Wow! This is way better than they used to be. So you just don't get to dodge for 20 turns, but you get to you get, you get get to turn someone against their enemies. Previously, it was like... Like, the effect was really powerful, but it often just killed you. Like, literally, you would just die upon clicking the button sometimes. So, um... There might be other ones that, that have more powerful effects, but this seems fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and accept this pact. How do I do that? Maybe I need to put it in my inventory or something. Oh, they, they're person to person. They're not, they're not the whole, like, each clone has a pact, not your whole, like, uh, ship. Um, so when I'll have to go into, like, a raid or whatever and do it, um, like, in raid. But I think I'll accept this. We don't dodge anyways. Doesn't decay as well? Yeah, so I can choose it whenever. Um, but on Percy, we, we don't dodge. Like, I don't, I, with the class we have now, we get a little dodge chance, but, um, I don't rely on dodge is what I should say. I, I just rely on, you know, his extra resistances and thick armor. So losing dodge chance for 20 turns is, like, not a big deal. And turning a hostile human into an ally could be massively important. Um, and the Quasimorphosis penalty is 200, so, like, you'll get plus 200 on Quasimorph. But if you're on, like, you know, Mars, then it won't happen. It is a big penalty, so I won't be, you know, spamming this willy-nilly. But I think this will get me out of a tricky, a tricky situation. I also can't speak. Um, and hopefully you, you don't die. Has anyone used these before? Do you turn into a Quasimorph at random? Did they get rid of that? Because that's what was so bad. Previously, you would use your, your pact, but occasionally, I would just turn into, like, a Hulk, which is a type of Quasimorph, and just die. You couldn't click any buttons, you couldn't use, you couldn't evac from a mission, you couldn't eat food, you just had to wander around until you starved to death. It was really annoying, so I'm hoping they've removed that. That was, that was a very bad mechanic, in my opinion. Um, so I hope that's gone, but we'll see, we'll see. So we, we got one done. Barely, but we got it done. And then I wonder if there's, like, anywhere else to go, any, like, any other, like, weird story stuff to do. Um, cause I just showed up here and there was a story. And where are we actually? Wrong. Does it tell me? Oh, orbit of Venus. Okay. I was like, does it tell me somewhere? It should. So we're on Venus. I could go here or here really quickly. Oh, that's the Texclon mission. What is this one? Oh, it's the four star mission. It's too scary. You turned to Hulk by only bone pack. Others don't have it. Okay. Okay. That's the, that's the one pact I would use. The one that gives you like extra shielding or whatever. You would turn blunt, like blood into shield. Um, I liked it, like, in theory, and then it just, like, would kill me. Um, and I couldn't ever, like, I tried testing it, and I couldn't figure out the, the exact reason why you would Hulk out. We did, like, different tests with it and stuff, like, over and over. And I could never really sort it out. We could go do these. This one will be done, but these two won't. Oh, this one will, but this one won't, at least. And it's for Realware against, uh, Daydream. Realware is, uh, currently top dog, so I don't mind working with him. Sure. They're, they're top of the market. I'll help them out. Stay there. So let's go over there and do that. That's fine with me. Uh, it was here, right? Yep. Okay. Okay. So we'll get there in six days. 
So we'll wait for the other one to be done. It should be done. Yeah, they're both done. Um, how much cloth do I have? Do I have like plenty? 30? Looks like 30, 35 cloth. Okay, not that many. Because it, it takes like two cloth to make each one. So like this is 10 cloth. So I'll, I'll make that. And then I'll make some of these. Because we need some of those. I'll actually do another stack of those. Because we don't have any. We had like none. So we'll do that. Um, but earlier when I was saying we have all this food, it's like infinity. I, it's not because we're competing with uh, for plastic with um, splints, and they don't give you anything back. They don't return the plastic, so we 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 do not have an infinite amount of food. I was wrong, but that's fine. Also, what is what is that? That little station. That's cool looking. The the stations are new. There used to just be planets. They didn't have any of these guys. So we'll do this. Are we? Do we need to craft anything? I don't think so. Okay. All right, let's let's hop into it. Let's get to it then. And we're just going to, you know, we're not going to start up a new character. We're going to keep trying to level up Percy. And they're pretty leveled already. As mentioned, these four level quickly, and these two level slightly slower. Other classes level way slower, though. Way, way slower. So we'll see. Um, Like if, if they're still super slow leveling up. Or maybe they've, you know, gotten a little quicker. Rotten meat. Oh, this was the idol. I forgot I picked it up. I was like, why does she have rotten meat in my inventory? But it was the idol I carried around. There was, there was, you know, nothing to do with it. It's fine that we, uh, like, it rotted. Honestly, we can turn it into antibiotics now. It's, it's really not a problem at all. Um, so do we have any more med kits or anything? We have a Sangbeezy one med kit and one mill med kit. Okay, I'll, I'll bring a Sangbeezy in. We have, we have normal medicine, so I can use these more liberally. I don't need to rely on this. And hopefully we don't get hit by an energy weapon. That really sucked, just, like, being sick the whole time on that one mission, so I don't know why I'm looking through there. But hopefully we don't get hit by anything. Oh, and I want the Pact so I can use it. Where's my Pact? Yo, let's go. And, uh, oh, Absorb, okay. The Pact with the Quasimorph will be impossible to break in the usual way. Remain in effect even after the death of the operative. Yep. Finally, you've kept your end of the bargain. From now on, we are bound together by an unbreakable Pact. Together, we will destroy Texclon. We must do this. Once a Freedom Fighter, the first amongst equals. Once a Freedom Fighter, first amongst equals in the Emerald Crystal of Ganix, the King has gone mad. He must be stopped. He, dre he dreams of the Emerald. Im his dre he dreams of the Emerald Empire. Wishes to expand it beyond Ganix. But he himself had once fought against the ins an insane tyrant possessed by the same delusions. I will stay in your realm on Venus. I will gather the Tauthnoms loyal uh, to Liberty and fight the Madman here. You must head to Mars. There's a place call you call Sinkhole Oasis. It's an ancient battlefield long before human ancestors looked up to the stars in fear. A battle took place there. Texclon himself took part in it. He emerged victorious, but there he lost his spear. It's pop. Popaltol. It's Popaltol. Yeah, it's Popaltol. Um, the symbol of the ruler's fate in the, of the em the symbol of the ruler's fate in the Emerald Kingdom was forever cast on Mars. If you acquire this spear, it is with its help that you will be able to, that you will be able to defeat the Madman. For your realm, it is salvation from the monster. For Ganix, it is the path to freedom. Okay. I um, mean, a lot of these words are um like like Mesoamerican. The, they, 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 the, all the aliens are inspired by like uh, the Mesoamerican cultures. Um, I will struggle with them. Um, I'm from Texas, so I've had a little bit of, you know, like I, I, I've heard these words before, you know, you know, just out of like history class and stuff. But I, I struggle with them a little bit. But I'll do my best. Um, if I ever do say something that's like purely wrong, I apologize. Um, they're just, you know, they're 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 tough words for me. Fool, I am Texclon, the Emperor of the Eternal Ganics, Lord of the Boundless Emerald Empire, the Scourge cutting the thread of fate. The leader of legions flying the banners of eagles, the, the banner of eagle, jaguar, boa constrictor, and and caiman. I am the one who has experienced worship. I am the one who will take Gagtunger's place. I am the one who is truly worthy to rule the solar system. I am the punishment sent by the universe. Bow your head, mortal. Submit. Accept your fate. In a realm devoid of golden light of the of the golden light of the sun, the green radiance of Ganix will bring life and death. All right, cool. It's Papa Lotta. It's Papalata? Man, I don't know. I will I'll just I'll try to say them at at, at like read time. When I see him, I'll try to, to say them correctly. Um, so they wanted me to go where? Back to Venus or something? Mars, maybe? I figure there would be a special mission related to it. Mars, okay. Is there not a special mission? It's not like I mean there's this one that's five star, but I think that's just a coincidence. Maybe I just will find it one day, doing a mission. Maybe it'll just show up or something. Um, for now, I'm just going to stay here and do the mission we're on. It's, it seems like the, the the lore there was not like... It wasn't like, go do this now. It was like, just get it, you know, go there and you'll get it done. 
So we'll do this. And it's a one star. Easy enough. We'll work for real wear. Seems solid. It's only two floors. I saw it there. Yeah, so easy enough. And we have the pact. So we'll try it. We'll use it. Probably like at the end before we leave. Oh, signature. Wait. Personal target signature. Okay. We have to kill someone. It's it's specifically kill a dude. The quest here is to kill um, one person. So I could I could blow through the whole first floor. So destroy. Yeah, target the manager. Um, but so I could blow through the whole first floor without killing anyone. And that would be fine. I just have to go to the second floor, kill one guy, and we're done. Signal lost rip. Mm, we'll do that. And we'll do that. Sure. Oh, did I? Yeah, I picked it up. Okay. Might as well pick up stuff. It's stuff. Oh, I'm realizing something now. Oh, that's annoying. Chat, we're not recording this. This is supposed to be recorded for YouTube. I'll have to just cut the VOD. Or, like, you know, strip it from the VOD. Um, that's fine. It's just slightly more annoying. It's like 1% more effort. You're gonna die. I, I shot you point blank. Ah, you took A damage? Okay, okay, you're gonna die now. The first shots must have just rolled. A uh, low rolled. Which, that can't, I can't speak. With his gun, that can happen pretty, pretty, like, aggressively because the low roll is 33 damage um and is that with my bonus yeah that's with the bonus damage like, that's way too high um but if you low roll and they have like decent armor they will just uh, oh my god they're throwing a grenade at me i i think i'm far enough away that's the grenade right there um okay but if you low roll and they have good armor or even if you have high roll and they have good enough armor your shots will just do nothing so with with like you know weaker weapons sometimes the the damage variation can be like very dramatic because sometimes you you know your shots do none and then sometimes they do like 12 per shot and with like you know 40 health 12 per shot would kill you. reload mm, they're throwing lots of grenades man they used to not throw this many i feel like they're getting pretty saucy with the nades i'm gonna pick up this shotgun uh because i think it's a good time for a shotgun let me have a turn the stun grenades. I'm just gonna die. They're just gonna shoot me to death. I get no turns. I'm stunned forever. Okay, I finally get a turn. It's my turn. My vengeance will be felt. Alright, and thankfully they actually didn't do much damage. These guys were pretty weak. But I wanted to pick up the shotgun just because I felt like it would blow through them a little quicker. Uh, they destroyed my armor. Jesus. They completely destroyed my armor. But that's okay. That's fine. We, we got new armor. That's all that matters. And we're probably, yeah, super broken. Uh, self healing. We have a, a pelvic fracture and an arm fracture and a foot fracture. Okay. So ripped all our splints, but whatever. It's fine. That's what we brought them for, you know? They're all used up, but they, they provided good value. Um, and that's what I'm talking about. Like, previously, getting stunned and shot that many times, you would die. The game would be over. I would not be playing anymore right now. At least not this run. I'd be playing, but a different, you know, a different character. It would be dead and reset. Oh, I need to fix this. This thing broke. But um, it seems they've really... Not stabilized wound. It seems they've really made it less one-shotty. Like, I got shot like six times there, dude. While I was stunned. I just stood there and got shot, and we're not dead. Like, that's, you know, an impressive change. Uh, I, I know it, if, you, if you're just seeing this for the first time now, you're like, I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's that one-shot, like, you know? But it really used to be. Back in the day, everything would one-shot you, if it hurt you at all. It either did, like, next to nothing or an insane amount, so... I, I, I keep saying it, but it's because I'm so impressed with the change. I wasn't really sure if they would be able to fix all the one-shotting. But it, Oh, food's unavailable? What? I got... My, my pelvis was shattered again? Okay. Food's still unavailable? Does this have to heal? Okay, for like... Oh, chance of recovery 70% over 9 turns. Okay, I guess everything has that. I thought that was like a special wound I had, but it seems that's just how wounds happen. I'll get rid of this, and I'll disassemble this, and disassemble this, and we'll carry some powder out. We'll, you know, other ammos we'll use as powder. And there's some slugs there. I'm carrying the slugs, because, uh, or these here, um, because I want to, um, just have extra ammo. Like, it's just more shotgun rounds. Oh, I meant to drag these here. Whatever, just disassemble. I don't need to drag them around. And we should get a full stack of, um, oh, and I should be disassembling the weapons. But we should get a full stack of powder here. Probably pretty easily, even. We might have, like, more than a full stack of powder. I'll repair both of these, one for each one, just because they're kind of broken. It shouldn't be too wasteful. Um, like, technically, I think we wasted a little bit of durability there, but just a, a tiny, teensy bit. The world's smallest waste, so it's okay. I can I can live with it. Nope, not available yet. 
and we'll disassemble, disassemble, weapon part, don't need it right now. Disassemble, disassemble, okay. There might be more weapons in there, but yeah, that's good. Ooh, a class chip, yo, that's what we're pogged about, chat. Class chips are where it's at. There's a, a chance it's my favorite class ever. Please be tunnel rats. Phoenix Brigade, okay. Phoenix, Phoenix Brigade is a very like flame oriented class. They like energy weapons and fire. Um, I thought they were pretty weak, honestly. Maybe they've had some balance changes or maybe my opinion on them was just wrong. But overall, I didn't have much respect for them previously. We'll have to see if they're good now. Um, but regardless, that is an item I could leave the mission with. So if stuff starts, if stuff starts getting really weird and sussy, I can just go ahead and leave with that item. If I, if I worry about death, that item will be my ticket out. Oh, a little, a little, little one of these guys. Um, yeah, short time to come. Um, these guys are annoying because they don't like, they don't give anything, and they're like, like kind of tough to kill. Um, I feel like these aliens are my my least favorite of them. The change with energy weapons not dealing fire damage. Probably so, actually. That that makes sense because the energy weapon indeed was doing beam damage. So. I, I bet you're correct. I didn't consider that, but I'd, I, I'd be shocked if they were exactly the same as before with, with uh, the change to energy weapons like that. So yeah, maybe maybe they're pretty sick now. We'll, we'll give it a try, of course. We'll give it its fair shake, its fair due day in court. Um, eight, 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 six. Oh, they, I'm wearing this armor. Okay, let's go. So I'm wearing this armor so I can compare them like this. Yeah, I want the one I have, I think. I don't know, these are better for shock and beam. It's tough. I don't know. I'll, I'll take one of them, I suppose. We'll take one. And do I want these boots or anything? The pants are really not bad. Hmm. Just don't get addicted. All right, let's go. Not addicted. You'll love to see it. We'll take the pants. And I want the ammo, too. But, again, there's, there's a lot that I want. There's this... You're always stuck not getting what you want in this game, essentially. There's always more loot on the ground that you want to pick up that you can't have. You just gotta, you gotta decide what you want right now. You know, what's more important to you on the day. Because all this stuff is pretty valuable, you know? Like, like, ammo's valuable, meds are valuable, the supplies to like, trade are valuable, so... You really gotta, like, dynamically decide what you need at any given moment. Also, how did you tank so many shots, brother? Like, please. What about you? Are you gonna die? It, it is a little damage. Okay, okay, let's go. You're stunned for it. How are you still alive? You were bleeding to death. Okay, you're not bleeding to death, I guess. Turns out it is me that's gonna bleed to death. No, that is should die. Okay, we're good, we're good. Um, what is this? Laceration? And minor contusion, that'll heal itself. Let's use a sorbent. Uh, my thing's broken again. I'll just leave those on the floor then. Ah! That's okay, he didn't have a, an energy weapon, but he scared me. The people with the jackets are terrifying, man. I'm gonna step forward and blast him. It's a suppressed weapon. You know what, actually? I'll let the uh, the alien and them fight it out. No, the alien's going my way. I was hoping the alien would go fight that thing over there. Or that guy back there. Okay, we killed him. So disassemble. Disassemble. Um, I'll disassemble the legend pants. That's fine. Or the legend boots. Eat the ammo. Eat the water. Uh, ceramic plates. Oh, yeah, this is what you need for the heavy armor. Sure, I'll repair them. And, okay, we got cloth. Repair? Repair probably works. Yeah, I figured that would work. Okay, drop that. And I'll take, uh, or I don't need to take these anywhere. I'll just repair again. Repair here. And we'll repair once more. Hopefully that's enough repair to get us out of here. Um, laceration, minor, okay. And then I'll pick my stuff back up. That's fine. Ah, why are there so many people? With a shotgun, that's okay. As long as it's not the little energy gun, the flash M or whatever, I'm okay with it. Okay, I wanted them to step away from the thing, so I didn't have to shoot through those to kill him. And we're picking up a little bit more shotgun ammo, and we'll eventually have enough to fire it some, you know? There's the elevator right there. What is this? Oh, a cable. Yeah, leave it. I want to cook anything? Ah, it's still the same weird stuff. I don't want to cook that stuff. That stuff is not what I'm trying to cook, y'all. We can cook other stuff, but I'm not trying to cook human skin. I'll leave that for the real psychopaths. We're the real desperate, I suppose. I might end up doing it later, and it'll be it'll be for pure desperation, I promise. And while we have this bonus, we do like a boatload of damage, so I don't want to like run away and try to reposition. It might be for the best to do that, like in general, but while while the buff's up, I think it's best to, to make use of it.
actually shot me to what I think is a better position to kill this guy. I think from down here, he would have maybe been covered by the wall. Are you almost dead or anything? Not really. One blast should kill you, or at least get you close enough to dead. Yeah, I don't have to worry about you. I'll turn this way. He might take a shot at me, but it'll just be one shot. And I'll go for a burst. Ah, I summoned an alien. It's annoying. That, that alien's tanky and annoying. I'll reload this. It's a, I think it's a decent time to reload. Arm laceration. We'll live with it. We'll live with it. Okay, you know what I'm going to go ahead and do? What? Wait, what? I feel I feel so robbed. No! Why didn't my thing work? Oh, we I should have I forgot we had the class chip too. We left we just kept playing with the class chip. Um why didn't I use my my thing? I clicked it and then I clicked them and then they just got turns. I I I must have I must have I I I must have done something wrong there. I don't know exactly what I did, but I didn't use it correctly. Maybe I need to hit the key P or something. Scammed? It, I, I kind of agree with that. I feel like I got scammed a little. Um, but that's all right. It is what it is. And you know what else it is, chat? Also, hope you're doing well, DJ Virus. It's good to see you. But you know what else it is? It's 2 o'clock, so we're going to close it up. I mentioned yesterday that I wanted to do an extra hour today, but we can't. I'm busy. Um, so we'll try maybe tomorrow to do an extra hour. But we'll be back tomorrow um, with more Quasimorph. And just like yesterday... We'll probably do, you know, Star Sector until about noon and then Quasimorph for the final two or three hours if we're able to, to play till 3 p.m. Um, but we'll be back again tomorrow. So thank you so much for being here, folks. If you were here for a moment, if you were here for an hour, or if you were here for the whole stream, thank you, it means so much. Thank you, everyone, for being here. It truly means the world to me. Um, I say it, you know, frequently, but it's it's so amazing having you all here to hang out with while I'm streaming. Hey everybody, Quist Gaming here. If you're enjoying the content, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It truly makes a difference. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.